Well, greetings and hello there, everybody. It's me, your beloved Star Wars dad. Back from a few days of vacation, feeling pretty good. And glad to be back here with all of you. I didn't check the music here. Let's make sure we don't have multiple pieces of music rolling while we're talking and enjoying ourselves. We do. We do have multiple pieces of music. I'm glad I checked. I'm glad I checked. Whenever you got... Uh, I, I do this from time to time. It's something I gotta work on. But, uh, hey. It's good to see everybody. Mythic, Chips and Doinks, Charlie Reed, Zion is over there. We've got uh, Tharolder and CT Drill and Heads and Fails over on Twitch. We got a... A lot of fun ahead of us today. We've got roster reviews. Vigo Martinson and Dakota Dakota Herniker is here, everybody. Snips has made the stream. Let's give Snips his master's level intro. I'm feeling kind of chill. Today. I feel pretty good. I had a little, just a little bit of time off to get away from it all. Hang on. I forgot to uh, preload everything in there. It's just going to be a mess. Watch this. Watch this. Let's fix that. Let's fix that. Hold on. Snips has been a member for 13 months. I'm glad to be back, too, sir. I'm glad to be back. 13 months, man. That's crazy. It's hard to believe. You know, we still have, we have people that have been members for two years now, and it's hard for me to really fathom that when I look back at everything over on YouTube. Hey, Hot Hot over on Twitch, and Taryn Greel is here as well. We've got a Kahoot today, folks. Let's load that Kahoot. I had it up there. There we go. Get in the Kahoot. The top winner today will win a roster review. I haven't received any gifts from anybody else, so just one roster review at stake today. It's going to be Star Wars trivia. I believe it's Star Wars trivia. Yeah, I think it's for it. I think it's general Star Wars trivia. So jump into the Kahoot. Go to Kahoot.it. Pin is eight two nine eight eight one six. We give away free roster reviews on every stream. We do it with Kahoots. We do it with wheel spins. Kind of varies and goes back and forth and everything else. So jump in the Kahoot to win a free roster review today. Let me get the wheel up and running so that in case we're good there. I think that's the wrong wheel. Let me see here. I think that's the wheel from... There's the... We did a different wheel. What was that? the different wheel we did? Maybe it's not. I don't know. that and that update the wheel yeah it might have been the right wheel i don't even know anymore i don't know guys i'm just here having fun chilling out hanging with you guys doing some roster reviews dank ideals uh, is joining the stream what's up dank dank loves bodie we all know this far and wide and near and far hey dank they found the Death Star plans. They have to transmit them from their communications tower. You have to take down the shield gate. Stand by, Rogue One. We're on it. This is for you, Caleb. Uh-oh. Remember when Star Wars movies had stakes where you could actually die if you got stabbed by a lightsaber or had a bomb thrown at you? Remember that? Remember when that was a thing? Hey, let's take a look at Dank, or excuse me, we've also got uh, John Rohr is one of our Masters members. John, let's get you loaded up here. Good to see you today. <laughs> and yeah, Exo, we can get your Masters review today. In your ally code, bud. Get in the Kahoot. Win a roster review today. What are my thoughts on the Acolyte trailer? That's, I mean... It's tough to get excited about Star Wars anymore just because um, it's like... They've failed so many times. Let's say hello to X-Zone, by the way. Disturbing is this move by Chancellor Palpatine. I understand. You are on this council but we do not grant you the rank of master. What? Yeah, I mean, oop, uh, wrong button, wrong button. Yeah, yeah. I did see the, um, I did see the Acolyte trailer. I just don't really, I just, it's hard for me to get excited about Star Wars. You know, these trailers come out and they look kind of cool, maybe. But they've kind of burned me. They've kind of burned their bridges with me right now. So 
I'll watch the first couple episodes of, of Acolyte. We'll see if it's any good. And if I don't enjoy it, it'll be the first Star Wars show that I just skip. So, um, uh, it's interesting to me that the show comes out in what? When does the show come out? Let's see here. Um, Acolyte 2024, that's not helpful. When's it coming out? June 4th. Okay. So, <clears throat> comes out June 4th, and it's been so two months from now, a little over two months. I'll give it a shot. Um, if I like it, If I don't enjoy it, I can make shorts. That's true, I do. <laughs> hey, Louie. Yeah, I, I I don't know. It just... Everything about Star Wars feels very generic right now. And I don't. I definitely don't know any of the characters. That are, like, it's a bunch of Jedi and a red lightsaber. And we've got uh, Trinity from the Matrix in it. And there was a bunch of Matrix fighting scenes which kind of bothers me like are we gonna get are we just gonna get like matrix light fighting scenes and is there actually gonna be any like they show is all the action in the show contained in the trailer like i don't know i hope it's good the soko was such a snooze fest man oh it's not another generic action adventure show yeah let's let's make it something interesting something that gives you know something that gives us uh gives us pause and makes us think about Star Wars and is fun. So, I don't know. Let's see. They should make stuff about Old Republic or Sith Empire era. Well, I think that's what Ryan Johnson's trilogy was going to be. Then they realized that nobody wanted to see another Ryan Johnson movie for Star Wars. So, isn't Harvey Weinstein's old? Yeah, she's the, she's the director, I think. She's running the whole thing. Hey, guys, you got about one minute left to get in the Kahoot. We got 23 folks. We're giving away one review. Hey, Dakota Herniker. Welcome to Nooch Masters, Dakota Herniker. Let's give you an master, intro. Master, 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 master. Good to see you, Dakota Herniker. What's up, man? Hey, if you want your review today, just let me know. Give me your ally code and I'll get your review today. Cornelius, how many reviews are in queue right now? Two. Plus the Kahoot, so three. Three reviews in Kahoot. Dave, uh, yeah, that uh, Ahsoka was, was bad. Ahsoka was bad, dude. Yeah, give me that ally code, Dakota Herniker. I don't, I don't think... Um, I think as more time passes, the more the more the Ahsoka passes too. Like when something's really good, it just sticks in your mind. You know, uh, Baby Yoda, which became Grogu. Which, by the way, didn't we think that gives you a slow thriller esque show? All that, yeah. Well, the Sith stay hidden. Yeah, we'll see. I loved Andor. Obi Wan Jubert. I loved Andor. So, you know, it's like uh, what am I trying to think of? Um, I was talking to Cosmo, because that's where my vacation was. I was with Cosmo all week. And it's like, when, remember when you first saw Baby Yoda, episode one of Mando, at the end of it, boom, there's a baby. Oh, and you're like, whoa, and you go nuts, and you lose your mind. And then, and you're th what my real true thought was when I saw Baby Yoda was, I'm going to learn more about this species. I'm going to find out who this species is, where they are, what they do, what comprises them. And we never even got a glimpse of that. Like, like Mando said, I'm going to go and find his tribe and return him to his tribe. And he just never did. That turned out to be the Jedi, which is, okay, that's fine. But I want to see his people. I want to, I want to see, we don't even know what their race is called, right? Do we? I don't think we know what their race is called. So, anyway. Gotcha, Dakota Herniker. See four two nine four nine two nine three three. Got about thirty seconds left for Kahoot. Everybody, get in there. Top winner, the top placer in the Kahoot wins a roster review. You kind of appreciate the mystery of the. I, 
somewhat agree with that, Charlie, but I also, if they're going to give us another... Honestly, that was just my first thought. When I saw Yoda, I'm like, oh, we're going to get to know more about the species. So, yeah, I didn't think we knew the name. Best part about the Mandoverse is Jack Black and... <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. Let's say hello to Deacon. We know who Deacon loves. Do you know who Deacon loves? Tell me in chat who Deacon loves. Do it right now. I'll give you guys a second to load it up before I get the... We're on a, we're on a short delay here, but if you tell me who Deacon loves in chat... You'll get a hearty uh, pat on the back from Deacon, and that was your last chance. <laughs> I thought the second season of Mando was fine until we got Luke Skywalker, which was awesome. Um, I don't think season two of Mando was peak Star Wars. I thought that season one was was great. Um, season two and a half was, uh, and then I thought that, um, what was I looking at? Oh, the last thing I said was peak Star Wars was the Millennium Falcon in the maw of the, um, Kessel Run. I thought that was, that whole scene was peak Star Wars. Whether you like Solo or not, when they're going, when, when they detour through, I think it's whatever you call it, the maw, the dark place where the big creature is and the Falcon is malfunctioning and not working they can't get the light speed going and then boom they just they just fly through it and they're 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 making jokes the whole it, that is peak star wars to me that's peak star wars i'm good speedy how are you doing welcome another masters member in the midnight hour she cried with a rebel yell i'd love to see in yeah yoda origin story man in the midnight hour babe hard, hard, with a rebel yell Yeah, that's a pretty good point, Theroldor, over on Twitch, is that, you know, we, we we put the whole Mando Season 2 into Boba Fett, and then we really kind of skipped out on on what Grogu and Mando could be doing that whole time, and it was really wasn't much, they didn't really expound much on that, it was unfortunate. I think Solo's underrated too, yes. I think Solo. Max Verstappen did not win the Australian Grand Prix. <clears throat> All right, guys, here we go. We're going to get this Kahoot started in. Let's get over to the Kahoot screen. Five, four, if you missed your chance to stop my problem. Two, one, let's go. The winner gets a free roster review today. Heads and fails. Rogue One final beater seen as peak. Yes, 100%. Star Wars quiz. Three, two, one. Let's see. Double points. What is the name of the actress who, the actress who voiced Ahsoka Tano? Type your answer. Ooh, man. Ouch. Type your answer. Better get it right. There she is. Uh, uh, here's a clue for you. She's married to... I don't know if they're... I assume they're still married. She's married to World Series MVP who played for the St. Louis Cardinals. She's married to a World Series MVP, MVP who played for the St. Louis Cardinals. Ashley Eckstein. Married to David Eckstein. Rain Pletcher, let's get Rain his uh, High Council intro before we move to the next uh, next question here. Rain loves we don't we also know why Rain loves. I saved you, Rose. I don't get it, Rain, but I love you, buddy. I'm glad you're here. We saved the things we love. I saved you, Finn, but they blew up the entire resistance. But I don't care. I don't care. Uh, only five people type that right. Is that right? Did only five of you guys type that right? Wow. All right. Got to type, man. You know, I got to type. What is George Lucas' net worth? Well, I have no idea. 150 million, 80 billion, 5.4 billion, 50 million. I know the answer based on what I see. 5.4 billion. Yes, that's why he gave the 4 billion to charity your city was going to. That's right, Rain. We're back from vacation. You said the actor by mistake. I put Ashley, but it got it. It's got to have the whole name, I think. Got to have the whole name. Ashley Eckstein would be her full name. Luda. I knew a Luda back in the day. How many seconds is Star Wars episode? How many seconds are in Star Wars episode three? How many seconds?
That's what I would have guessed. But I'm not sure I would have, I'm not sure I would have enough time to get that. Wow. Ouch. David Eckstein, the tiny assassin. Who played shortstop for the Cardinals? Somebody said something here. You might see the Yoda. Did you see the 5,000 gems for? Yes. Forget that, Joey. Although there are, at least they took all the old characters off this time. You might get a Yoda Origins and the Acolyte he's around then. I just don't believe that. I, I mean, it'd be cool, but I mean, uh, by the way, Luda, um, I'm going to assume this is not the Luda that I know because Luda I know is a lady and I haven't seen her in a long time, but um, went to college with Luda. By the way, so the folks I went to college with had a connection with um, a, a pretty solid connection with, because I was a theater major, um, with Zach, with, um, not Zack Snyder, with um, James Gunn. And uh, James, what was the movie James Gunn directed? Dawn of the Dead. Okay, so we're going to look up this film here. Just for fun. There's a character in here named Luda. This character was named after the Luda that I went to college with. Like, literally. I think it was her first and last name. See down here. I guess it's just Luda. So, this person, because the folks I went to college with was a theater major with, again, had a very tight in with James Gunn. Um... This character Luda was named after the Luda that I went to college with and went to Hollywood, so and and became a hairdresser actually. So there you go. Strike mark is money. Uh, Mischievous Grievous, uh, six month mark. Can I go? Oh, hang on a second, buddy. Which of these ships is not part of executive requirements but is needed for the fleet? I know this. One. Mischievous Grievous says, "What up, Mr. Nooch? Six month mark. Hey, six months, man. Like, can I claim the review today? Also, any thoughts on the act? Like we're just talking about that. I got gotcha, you, uh, Mischievous." Your ally code. That'll be a five minute review for a five minute Ross review member or five minute uh, uh, Knights of Nooch member. The chat room is open, by the way. Uh, Xandu Blood. Yeah, well, I'm just not, I'm just not excited for Acolyte. They just haven't done anything recently to get me excited about Acolyte, you know? How many territory battle characters do we have in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes? Ooh. Three, four, ten, five. One, two, three, four. Okay. Yeah, five. This is good. Hey, Louis in first place. Look at you, man. Even though you're you're a Formula One racer lost. When was Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes released? Come on, kids. Come on, kids. Oh. Very specific dates, but I know it's really Main problem with Solo was they crammed too much of Han's character into one movie, which makes it seem like he has no achievements in A New Hope. Yeah, I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that. They crammed, I've said this many times, they crammed Indy's entire origin story with his scar. His, muse his wanting things in the museum, his snakes, his whip, I mean, his hat. They crammed that all into 15 minutes at, of Last Crusade, so it took a whole movie to do it for Han Solo. I'm good. I'm good with it. Didn't bother me. Louis still in the lead. How many stars in Rote Battle has the, did the number one guild get? So what's the maximum stars anybody's achieved so far? 44, 45, 46, 54. I have no idea. <sighs> 44, all right. Three people got that. I need your ally code, Mischievous. How is, what is, uh, what is the special ability in Galaxy Heroes of Capital Ship Executor called? The special ability that quote, saw, we saw in the original trilogy of Star Wars, okay. You only need to keep them from escaping, breach of protocols, Vader's bounty, unorthodox methods, something special planned, call reinforcement. Something special planned. Man, these are fast questions, boys and girls. 
These are fast questions. The Enterprise, something special planned for them. It's the, uh... Now witness the fire power of this fully armed and operational battle station. How old was Mark Hamill when he played Luke Skywalker in Episode 4, A New Hope? 19, 26, 40, 34. Look at those eyebrows. You got thick old eyebrows. I've never noticed that before. 26. That's what I would have guessed. I think character was 19. I like the fast questions, honestly, River. I get it. They're pretty fast compared to normal. Type your answer. How many episodes are in Star Wars The Clone Wars? How many episodes? Type your answer. Type your answer. I don't know. Uh, 133. Six people got it right. Noise. Apple E is at the top right now and in prime position for a rot at least eight. You're right about that. It was at least eight. How many Kairos in total do you need to finish the Grand Inquisitor journey requirements? The journey requirements. That's going to be five characters. 2,000. 2,000. Hey, XLSO Green, what's up? Been a long time, man. Apple E still in the first place. Still in first place. How many scoundrels are in Galaxy of Heroes right now? That's a good question. 87, 36, 51, 62. Fifty-one. It is a lot of scoundrels. I think that's either, either scoundrels or rebels are the biggest faction. Either scoundrels or rebels are the biggest faction. How many questions we got left here? It's Apple E and Louie that are fighting for it. Three questions left. Double points right here. How many seconds of screen time does Ahsoka Tano have in total? This is a swag, a super wild arse guess right here. 6,365. 11 people actually got it right. That's amazing. All right. Apple E is kind of cruise in here now. Apple E is on cruise control, boys and girls. Two more. Type your answer. Double points. Type your answer. Who voiced Darth Bane in Star Wars The Clone Wars? Who voiced Darth Bane in Star Wars The Clone Wars? Type your answers. Let's see what the answer is. George Lucas, maybe. Sam Walton, really? Really? Nice! I didn't know that. That's awesome. Alright, guys. Oh! Apple E, then X Zone. X Zone, you're a Masters member, so looks like Apple E's in prime position to win a roster review today. Here we go. Last question of the day. Double, a uh, multi select. Yeah, double points. Somebody can pop in here. What Lego Star Wars sets are going... Uh, which of these Lego Star Wars sets are going to retire in 2024? TIE Bomber, Clone Commander Cody Helmet, Ghost and Phantom 2, UCS Venator Class, Republic Attack, Attack Cruiser Tanta 4, or Executor Super Stardust. Which one is going to retire in 2024? I've been good, Finn BB. We'll say hello to you in a minute here, my friend. TIE Bomber, Clone Commander Cody Helmet, and Ghost and Phantom 2, and Executor. So do you get, I guess, you have a good chance to get that right. Let's see who's our winner here. The winner gets a free roster review today. Joey Santiago. Good job finishing third. Sorry I don't have one for you today, buddy. X-Zone is in second, and the top is going to be... Unless something crazy happen, Apple E. Apple E, give me your ally code in chat, either on Twitch or YouTube, and we'll get you 
your free roster review today. Apple E. We got, uh, hello there, Shrek Harvey. Hello there, uh, San Holo. Apple E, give me that code. We're giving you a roster review today, my friend. Louis, you started off strong and finished a little bit weak. Finished a little bit weak. Let's say hello to Finn BB, my friends. Give him a big master's intro. Master, 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 master. All right, so we're gonna start off with uh well we don't have Apple's code yet, so we'll start off with Charlie Reed. Charlie Reed, Charlie Reed. Mr. Reed, Mr. Reed. Appley, give me that ally code, my friend. Put some X's in there. There is Appley. Put some X's in your ally code like people have done previously. Then I'll be able to see it. Otherwise, I can't see it. All right. Higiyama. The Senate's Karelia. So, uh, my understanding is Charlie's just inherited this account. Is doing Inquisitors, Jedi Master Luke, and Leviathan. What else? Or what should he be doing? Good game, Joey. There we go, Apple. By the way, everybody, voice chat is open on Discord. If you want to join the reviews, you can go to voice chat. Uh, all right. Leviathan, JMS Luke, Inquisitors. What else should he work on? We got Executor. Let's see those Sith ships. We got some work to do here. I mean, Leviathan doesn't look like it's right around the corner. That's complete. You could use a relics. You could use some relics here, but that's complete. All right, we got a completed Marauder. You could use some gear levels on your Bad Batch to make that Marauder work. Um, let's go up here. Sun Holo, thank you for the Prime membership, my friend, or Prime subscription. I got to use the verbiage. Thank you, Sun Holo. Appreciate you, buddy. Thank you for the support. This fleet's looking good. All right, we're in pretty good shape with the fleets. The fleets are in pretty good shape. You messed it up. It's 812-113-138. Gotcha. All right, we got Kylo, we got Ray, we got Jedi Master Luke. He's finishing that. Working on Inquisitor, Jedi Master Luke, and Levy. Leviathan. Okay, so you're working on Jedi Master Luke's ult. So that's good. Let's look at those Inquisitors. And we'll look at the Sith, too. Okay, you're, I mean, you're looking pretty good here. Looking pretty good here. And then, let's look at your Sith, because you said you're going for the Leviathan. Need, need. Need, need. Um... Need, need. And no Darth Malgus, so... How close are you to Darth Malgus? Cal Kestis as well? Bad Batch, Plo, and... Bra well, what else you want? Pick, you gotta pick one thing at a time, man. <laughs> How close are you to Darth Malgus? Because you're gonna need him to get this done. That's an okay. That's alright, Darth Revan. It's not, like, super fast, but it certainly is alright. You're... You're Jedi out Cal Kestis. Let's take a look. Well, okay. I didn't see Seer Junda at all. So you're just throwing out stuff you're thinking about. I mean, honestly. Um... Here's what you do. So you're looking at Inquisitors, Jedi Master Luke, Leviathan. How are you on Malgus? You're only 136 mal. Well, so yeah. So let's 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 back up. Let's 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 slow our roll a little bit, my friend. Charlie Reed. 
think you're kind of, you're, you're, I mean, you're thinking way out ahead, and that's not a bad thing at all. That's not a bad thing at all. What was I going to look at? Um, what was I going to look at? I like the... I don't know what I was going to look at. Ah, I'm fading. I know what I was going to look at. I like the fact that you're thinking way out. However. However. You are ready to... You are ready to embark upon a profundity farm right now. You have all the characters finished. You've got even some of them com almost completely finished. I mean, you are ready for uh, a uh, profundity farm right now, my friend. So. All right, here's what I think. Wait, I gotta look some more. They moved the hot cartel. Okay. Oh, no, not at all, okay. So, you're getting bored of vessel cards. You read this lost if I don't have my other accounts. I'm just looking for places I haven't played with. Okay. Well, I got it now, Mr. Grievous. I got it. So, you finished Luke's ultimate. And then do your Inquisitors. So you don't want Profundity? Is that what you're saying? I mean, do you just not want to do Profundity? I would go ahead and do the Inquisitors for the guild. Get your Inquisitors to Relic 5 to get Grand Inquisitor and do Relic 7 to get Reba. If that's the goal. I would finish the Inquisitors. Go ahead and finish them. It's fine. Now... You're, you're, yeah, okay, go for profundity, please. Yeah, you're set up for, so here's what you do, okay? Here's what you do. You're gonna do Inquisitors, Profundity, Jabba, Inquisitors, Profundity, Jabba, Inquisitors, Profundity, Jabba, maybe even Jedi Master Kenobi, and in the meantime, you're going to be sharding for Leviathan and Jedi Knight Cal, okay? Inquisitors, Profundity, Jabba, maybe even Jedi Master Kenobi, and then do your sharding for Leviathan and Jedi Knight Cal Kestis. And do you have Commander Ahsoka? I don't think you did. Get Commander Ahsoka. Why this roster should have Commander Ahsoka on it? So get Commander Ahsoka. You don't want to do Jedi Master Kenobi until you have Commander Ahsoka. So that's your farming path. That's your fry. You could even go Profundity Inquisitors, since you've already got all the pieces for Profundity, and you got to go farm some characters for Inquisitors. But I think that for the Inquisitors, these guys are going to be... They're going to require can, uh, Cantina Energy to farm Seven Sister and Night Sister. I think Night Sister is a regular energy farm, actually. So Seven Sister, I think, is Cantina. So that will pull away from your signal data. So... Profundity Inquisitors, Inquisitors Profundity, and you're going to shard Leviathan and Jedi Knight Cal in the meantime. That's what you're going to do. Now let's take a look at some mods. While I'm looking at mods, hey, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, you know what it's time to do? It's time to hit that like button. You know when you like and subscribe, good things happen in your life. It makes Mitch's, Mrs. Nooch happy, it makes me happy, and it makes all of our viewers happy. Your life changes when you like and subscribe. Look at look at our, our, our subscribers, our members, people that 
people that have done nice things for and on the channel, amazing things happen in their life. You know, your, your, your life just absolutely changes. You get bags of money on your doorstep. Um, you know, you, 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 I don't even know what else it says. You subscribe, you win, you win $100,000 billion. I mean, it's just crazy, you know, so make sure to like and subscribe so that good things will happen in your life. Uh, make, make Mrs. Nooch happy. Just make good things happen. Just make me, don't make Mrs. Nooch mad. Yeah. You don't want, we don't want that. Knights of Ren. We don't want Mrs. Nooch to be mad. We want her to be happy. So anyway, make good things happen in your life. Make good things happen in my life. I appreciate your support. It's just really, it's just really, uh, you guys, I can't say enough. I appreciate all of you. You're all wonderful people. I don't care what Dank Ideal says about you. You're all amazing. All of you guys on Twitch are amazing. All you guys on YouTube are amazing. You're all just incredible. I'm so glad you're here. I just enjoy spending time with you. And uh, yeah, I look forward to it every, all the time. I always look forward to coming on and spending time with you guys. So, hey, let's hear from our lurkers too. If you're lurking, if you are work lurking, if you're lurking, if you're lunch lurking, if you're dishes lurking, if you're just mowing the wall lurking, give me a big L in chat. WL for work lurking. Let me know that you're lurking. We'll give you a big shout out here while we pull up Charlie Reed's mods on this new account. Inquisitors are Robert Eater and JF Trippity Grain. Okay, so shard those guys. Go do profundity first and shard the Inquisitors. Do profundity first and shard. Hey, Salacious Scrum, what's up? Last time I liked the Nooch video, I got an R10 ETH Koth. Who wouldn't want an R10 ETH Koth? Hot Hot is lurking. Second, I gotta delete this. Let's see here. Hot Hot is lurking over on Twitch. We got CT Drill lurking at work. Work lurking. Over on YouTube. Zion, Gabriel, Claire Light. Claire Light. Is that played to? Where's Claire Heavy? Uh, Nasty Balls, Knights of Ren, Patrick O'Brien. Patrick O'Brien. Will Herod, Rowdy, Knights of Ren, Big Texas, Knights of Ren again. Deacon. 12 months later, he provided the whole guild one big fat Reva shard. That's right, Deacon. I did my second one yesterday. Uh, Gray78, Kalulir, Mythic, Ubaj, Finn, I Married Bacon. I guess you love it. Uh, K-Pod, Mischievous Crews, John Rohrer, House Cleaning Lurking, good for you. Nasty Ball, Joey Santiago, Sean Johnson, Zatnold. Uh, da -da 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 Knights of Ren, Dank Ideals, Count Dooku, Penguin the Twelfth. Cyberblock, Chris Habig, Count Dooku, and Louis Holden. Good to see everybody. Anybody else on Twitch? No, that we got. Those are our lurkers. Thank you for lurking. I love my lurkers. I'm so glad everybody's here today. Again, you're all wonderful people, and I appreciate you, and I all the support you give the channel, all the fun we have together. Let's take a look at these mods. Looks like the Rod mod, right mod set. Uh, if you can get an offense mod here, it's better than health, but I like the speed. I definitely like the speed. You'll get a lot of siphons with that speed. But, you know, if you get an offense there, it's better. Joe Correa has popped in with 20 gifted memberships. Let's say hello to Joe Correa, and then we'll make it green here in one moment. Daddy's home, everybody. Where is... Oh, no, I can't find it. Wait. Mm -mm. Let me reload that. Mm -mm -mm. Daddy's home. Joe, happy Sunday, and thank you, and good to see you today, sir. Let's give Joe his master... I already did that. Uh, let's go back to... What's Joe doing? He's making it green. Let's go find making it green. Yeah. Gotta get back in the swing of things. Although I'm always like this, aren't I? Make it green. Let's take a look at who all got a gifted membership just now from Joe Correa. Let's read them off. Zion, River Crazy, and Ubaj, Claire Light, Count Dooku, James, Bootstrap James, Turner, Shower Lurking. Maybe you didn't get a gifted membership. You already... Shower Lurking, that's a little too much info. I forgot some lurkers here. Hold on. Um, Pierce, Pierce Deary is lurking. Uh, Marcus Money, Zeta, E-Man, of course. Uh, dropped him as Prime, Jam Wah, Tyler Baslin, Jesus Dominguez, Swift Blade, uh, Rule of Two, Dark Grogu, J Dub, Ade Ragu, Tobias Gustafson, The Dave, and Connor Ellis are uh, now members of the New Too Good channel. Thank you to Joe Correa. I appreciate you, buddy. You know I do. 
All right. What's with all the blue rhino talk today? Yeah, you actually... Are we talking about the Darth Malak level of... Yeah, the Treya team works there, I think. Let's see how fast Mara Jade is. With, with potency, she's pretty fast. All right, mods are in pretty good shape. Let's do that a little bit. So, it's the guild you're in. All right. Let's see here. So, let's go down here. Do we have a 300 speed boss? We should. On, the, on a roster this size... We should have a 300 speed boss. We don't. He needs some more speed. You do need more speed on this roster. At your at your galactic power, you should have a 300 speed boss. That's that's absolute. Absolute. So. Thrawn. I mean, do you really need to get Thrawn going fast? 292. I mean, yeah. Whatever. Thrawn. Ah. Hey, man. There's your roster. That's your farming path. Uh, since you got Gideon's Zeta... It's not the leader, Zeta. No. I would probably work on getting Gideon to at least gear 12 so you can use him in a Gidmay team. There's next farms, man. There's next farms, Charlie Reed. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. All right, let's go take a look at Apple E, who won the Kahoot today. All right, we got... Hold on a second. Hey, Mr. Grievous, I wrote down that you already got a review. Colton 1975! I've already got you down for a review, Mr. Grievous. Let me take a look here. Colton 1975. Back to March for roster reviews. Only free. Live, live roster reviews. back to these reviews we did earlier in the month. Yeah, we did you, Mr. Grievous. You're, um, you are in the video from March. Where's the date? March 8th at the, uh, 254, 50, uh, 255 mark. Cornelius McCarthy! Seven months ago, you remember, Oscar, I'd kind of done what you said, but I also did my own thing. Fair warning, I am still in the middle of a modding crisis. Oh, my. I will get you on the list here, my friend. We'll take the spot of Mischievous Grievous, who tried to who tried to bag me for two reviews this month. Yeah, technically you could, Mischievous Grievous. If somebody wants to review today's road, yeah, you can do that. You can do that. I thought the review was once a renewal, not once. It's once a month. It's once a month. Yeah. it's I, I can't keep track of her. So I can't keep track of renewals. YouTube keeps track of renewals. And they and I would have, for me to manually keep track of when somebody renewed and get it in there. And then when they came on, that's just, it. it's just too, it, uh, once a month is just way easier. And maybe if it was on the 8th, you're kind of quick here. Just come back in a, come back in a week plus and we'll get you a roster review. Um, we'll get it done for you, man. We'll get it done for you. I can even do it on a video if you'd like. If you want me to, I can do it on a on a on a video. Um, just go fill in the uh, the spreadsheet. There's a there's a link to the spreadsheet. All right, Cornelius, I got you, buddy. All right, so I got two accounts. You see, I have two accounts. You see, but drinker, you say. <laughs> 
We have to see more lightsabers, you see. <coughs> Excuse me. I know, I know half of you got that joke. I know half of you got that joke. But, Mischievous, hey, next month, um, I mean, that'll be after, it's the, thing, the thing is, if you look at, when you, sub the, the, the subscriptions are monthly on YouTube, and so, and then the, the memberships, the subscriptions are monthly on, on Twitch, memberships are monthly on YouTube, so you do get one every time you renew, it's just, just one every calendar month, otherwise I can't track it, so... Know what I mean? Know what I mean? What do you pay for a membership? Well, uh, that don't, uh, don't need a certain amount of so high. Hey, buddy, Limitless, take a look at the pinned message. Kind of goes over everything there, and there's a video in the pinned message that explains everything in full detail, my friend. But welcome aboard, Limitless. It's good to see you today. All right. Apple Storm Pooper Empire. For me to poop on. This is one of my favorite. I've, I've seen this kill before, and I like it. I like it. Are we blind? Read the pinned message. All right. My initial impression. Here's my initial impression of this roster. What do you guys think? What's your... Let's let's just page through this real quick. Real quick. What is your initial impression of this roster? Drop it in chat on Twitch and YouTube. Because I'm going to give you a 10 seconds and I'm dropping it myself. What's your initial impression here? Let me know. Let me know. It's a little broader than that. You must unlearn what you have learned. Nasty right, balls got it. Try. No. Try not. Teams. Farming. Finished. They must be. I, I, I just, you know, I think we'll probably look at Ray here too, but when I see the roster... The thing that sticks out to me is on the first page is Jedinette Revan at gear 12. And then Commander Luke Skywalker at gear 12. The two Zetas, did you get the right ones? Yes, you got the right ones. Okay. And then Treya at gear 12. Like the first three gear 12 characters are just begging for a full team to be finished. There's Han Solo at gear 12. Um... Darth Nihilus. I mean, their teams are just waiting to be finished. Yeah, right here's a full team that you don't have finished. Revan, Bo Jolie, Yoda, Bastila. Then your CLS teams. Apple says CLS is a priority. Yep, yep, yep. CLS, Han Solo, Chewbacca, Chupio. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ugh, no 3PO for you. Limitless! All right, man. Full review. Give me that ally code, my friend. Limitless. Isn't that a movie? I'm sure it is. Let's look at this resistance here. I'm, I'm pretty sure that you've got Ray queued up, right? BB-8, Scavenger, Jedi Training Ray, okay. No Radis, huh? Oh, you didn't buy the Radis bundle. You didn't buy the Radis bundle? You bought the finalizer bundle. Bow to the first order. That sucks. That sucks. Fleets are a little, little lacking. A little lacking. I bought just resistance bundle for Zori. Finalizer bundle is mainly for executor. All right. Well, at least you're farming the ships. Bow to the first order. 
<clears throat> Limitless, I need your ally code. I need you to have it needs to have X's in between the numbers, or I can't see it. Like three numbers X, three numbers X. Look at how Cordelius put his earlier. I can't see the numbers otherwise. Finalize the was mainly for exec here. Okay, I mean. But, I mean, if you have limited funds, you don't want to spend everything. I get it. I mean, I'm not going to complain about it. You do have the rest of the resistance, almost. Um, trooper. Yeah, you've got them all. Except for the SMA veteran. No, he's there. The SMA. I, there you go, Limitless. Thanks. Killing me, Smalls. Killing me. Apple, what are you using? You're 3.5 million. Hey, Happy, thanks for following over on Twitch. You've made a good decision today. Colcha bundle account. Lightspeed bundle account. Lightspeed bundle. Yeah, it is a Lightspeed bundle account. So it's, it is a pretty new account that's just fueled by the Lightspeed bundles that were purchased. You're right about that. You're all right about that. <clears throat> right? All right. Hey, Jimmy Jam 1310 over on Twitch. Thanks for following, my friend. Um, hey, so here's what you need to do with this account. Here's what needs to be done with this account. I want you to finish your farms. You need to finish your Jedi Knight Revan team, which is Jedi Knight Revan, Jolie Bindo, Bass Lashawn, and Yoda. And finish means at least Relic 3, okay? I want you to finish your CLS team. You need to get Ewoks. You need Ewoks for this team to get 3 PO. So I'd be farming Ewoks to go get 3 PO. It won't be that hard of a farm. Based on what you got here, uh, well, you got to get Chirp up to seven stars. You need Elder. You might as well go ahead and farm Princess Nisa. Oh, maybe you'll wait on 3PO until she's double drop farmable. That's going to be a few months. I don't know when Princess Nisa was released. I think we're at to, we're to a point on the Leia characters that... If you don't have them at seven stars, it might be best to wait at this point. Except for Captain Rex, you have to farm Captain Rex. Hey, the one! All right. Mods haven't been your friend. Oh, I got you, Cornelius. Okay. Gotcha. Um... All right, the path is clear and laid out before us. So here is the path. Are we ready? Who are we talking to? Appley, here's your path. You're going to finish Executor. You're going to finish Jedi Knight Revan team. You're going to finish a modified Commander Luke Skywalker team. Work on those Ewoks in the background. But Commander Luke Skywalker, Chewie, Han, and Chupio. Use R2 in there. Maybe or Old Ben or something. I don't care. Well, Old Ben's probably your Starkiller team. 
You're going to finish your Treya team. So Treya, Nihilus, Scion, Savage, Oppress. I need, I need Savage Oppress with an Omicron. Ooh, that didn't work. I need Savage Oppress with an Omicron for that Treya team. You got him. Okay. So you're going to finish Treya, Scion, Nihilus. You're going to finish... Jedi Knight Revan, Jolie Bendo, Grandmaster Yoda, Bass Lashan. You're going to finish. You, you might be able to leave Bass Lashan to gear 12. That might be okay. You're going to finish. CLS, Han Solo, Chewbacca, and Chupio. Shard Chupio right now. You're going to start sharding Ewoks in the background. If you want to wait until... When is... Let's see. When did... um? When did Princess Nisa come out? That doesn't help me. When was the release date? Kit reveal. July 11th, 2023 was the kit reveal. So sometime in July, somewhere in the range of three and a half to four months, Nisa will be double farmable. You've got enough work on your hands until that point. So what I would do with your Ewoks is this. Chirpa, Elder, Low Gray, Wait for Nisa to be double farmable, then you farm her and Wicked at the same time, okay? Chirpa, Ewok Elder, Low Gray. Then you're going to farm Wicked and Nisa at the same time whenever she becomes double shard farmable. And then you can go into that uh, 3PO event with like, I don't know, gear 8 Ewoks and just run right through it with Princess Nisa. I'm told she just blows right through it. So I think you need a Zeta on her, but just that's where you're going to do that. So that's down the road, okay? So... Executor, Jedi Revan team, CLS team, Treya team, and I need you to farm Wampa and Hermit Yoda, okay? Wampa and Hermit Yoda need to be on your roster. You're going to work toward Jedi Knight Luke. After you get CLS done, work your way to Jedi Knight Luke. Then you can do Jabba or Jedi Master Luke, probably Jedi Master Luke on here. You'll need to work on Com uh, Captain Rex as well. I would start doing that right now. This is a one character. Where is he? If you can do him twice a day, if you can do them twice a day, great. If not, maybe wait till double drops, but I just think Captain Rex is so, so valuable. He turns a non, non, you got a Zaydon Hera for whatever reason. He turns a non-interesting team into an end game team. So Captain Rex is a must farm. And also, while you're working on all of that over on your ships, I need you to pick a path here. You either need to pick a negotiator path or you need to pick a separatist path. The separatist will be easier it's just three Geos and then your droids get you a Geo team. The Galactic Republic's a little more challenging, but I need you to get Negotiator or Malevolence. Pick your poison and farm the fleet that goes along with those ships. Use your Get 2 currency for Malevolence or, or Negotiator. Until you, and until you have both of them unlocked at seven stars, that's the only place you should be spending Get 2 currency in the game, okay? Um, and there you go. No, you, you should not farm gear. Okay, here's the deal. You should not farm gear with your get to currency, or excuse me, your guild, your mark two raid currency, and your get one currency, right? You should not farm gear with that until Wampa and Hermit Yoda are unlocked and done. You shouldn't farm gear with that until you have Wampa and Hermit Yoda. And if you're ever going for gas, you're going for Malik, then you're going to save up the, that stuff too to get them done when they're done. So... You, the characters come first of that, and then the gear. Maybe I should, that's a... That's a... Um, Yeah, gives me an idea. Anyway, so, yeah, and, and by the way, while you're doing all of that, I want you to farm. You, you, you're going to have the resistance there. So while you're doing all of that, I want you to farm for the Radis. You've already got um, Hound's Tooth done. You've got some ships to farm for the Radis. I want you to farm for the Radis. While you're doing all that, you're going to shard the Radis. Because Galactic Legend Raid would make a big difference on your roster. And there you go, Appley. That's the roster. Look at some mods, but your mods aren't really going to be there. Um, 
you're still pretty new, so I don't think your mods are going to be here. Oh, these are pretty good. That's a nice mod set. Does that mean I should prioritize Wampa and Hermiota over gear for Janet Revan? Yes. Yes. Get those two unlocked first. They're great characters. I mean, they're just amazing characters. They should come first, and then you do the gear. Absolutely. Absolutely. Nikolai Moller, what's up, buddy? It's good to see you. How you doing? It's, it has been a while. I don't even see your membership on there anymore. It's good to see you. How's life been? How's life treating you? Work on your mods, but I think you're working on that, so, yeah. Uh, I use Nisa and no Zeta G11 all. Uh, I use G11 all. You had no Zeta on Chirpa? Is that what you're saying? I I I did them all G11 without Nisa, so that's not really much of an accomplishment, Taren Grill. Sorry, buddy. I did them all G11 multiple times without without uh, Nisa. All right, X Zone. Let's take a look at what you got. Wrong place. Got distracted. Uh, all right, excellent. Let's see. One, four, five. I just unlocked Leia. I'm close to Java, but we need a lot of relic levels. Eye Bones Brigade! I'm doing both profound. I'm doing profound now, but interested in your view on my roster. Okay. Absolutely. Five minute review for Eye Bones. All right, um, X Zone 5. Let's see what we got. Good to see you, X Mode. Oh, X Mode is over on Twitch and. Wait, X Zone and X Mode. I'm confused. X Zone. You recently unlocked several conquest units plus Reva. Ooh, nice. Let's look at that. Should be getting Bane and Padme. Ooh, fancy. Uh oh, we got it. Is this a flex? I feel like this is a flex. Gas is above Leia Organa. Wow. So Gas at Relic 8 is above Leia Organa until she gets her ultimate. Yowza. What's that, dude? She's very usable without her without her ultimate. I mean... I would get some mods on her. She's very usable. Uh, she's very usable even without her ult. Take these two over to the garage, will you? I want them cleaned up for dinner. But I was going into Toshi Station to pick up some power converters. First, you've got to fix your mods. Speed, huh? I will say, the one time that I struggled with a gas on defense, CLS versus gas on defense, was when gas had a lot of speed. It really threw me off. Really threw me off. So the only Galactic Legend you're missing is Jabba. Very yachty today. Oh, we're well, working on Jabba. You're definitely working on Jabba. All right, you're, on, you're nearly there. So Jabba's right around the corner. Yeah, I think with Leia has mods, she'll go. She'll move past gas. Let's see what the power is. Forty-one six one. Thirty-eight one hundred. Uh, I don't know if mods will do it or not. Do mods give you two thousand galactic power? I really don't know. I mean, it's just it's just a nice roster. So you're working on profundity right now. Do you already have Leviathan? No Leviathan, huh? So we got profundity at five stars. Ew! Yuck! Where's all your Sith ships? 
Where's all the Sith ships? Where are they? Me no see Sith ships here. What are we missing? The, um... I don't even recall. The Mark VI, right? Which is flown by... Sith Empire Trooper. We don't even have the ship? Now we're missing Malgus's, um... Whatever it is. Huh. Well, you're close to Java. You're a long way from, um... Just got Malgus too, huh? Nah, I got a lot of sleep on vacation. It's kind of getting back in the swing of things, that's all. Woke up a little bit later today. That's why. No video this morning. <clears throat> kind of adjusting from the clean, crisp air of the mountains to the uh, dirty pollen air of the Midwest. I am having a good weekend tonight, hero. Didn't play the account for a while, so I missed a lot of conquest stuff. Okay. I think a conquest stuff you need. So you had you said you had Reva. So you have you need to gear up Reva and Malgus, and you need to get Malgus's um, Fury class interceptor. I was in the Rocky Mountains. I was in Montana. Um, I think the roster's in good shape. Yeah, then you need Dr. Afra, Cal Kestis, Bo-Katan, Jar, Jar Jar. You haven't done any of those. Who's Ben? You need to work on Ben. That's a big deal. Savage Press is missing, and that's a big deal. Reef Karga is a big relic to have. The Aiden teams. You're just kind of short on teams here. I mean, it's a nice roster, man. Mods give 2295 power of the full set. Cool. There you go. Thank you, Charlie Reed. Hey, for those interested, uh, once I finish Jabba, which is going to be a couple of months, um, maybe a couple, maybe a little more than a couple of months, but two to two and a half months, we're going to finish Jabba on the free-to-play account. I'll take a couple weeks off. Then we're going to start a brand new free-to-play account on the channel. You can right now make suggestions on my Discord. It's the uh, free-to-play. So what's the room called? I'm going to go to my Discord. You can go into the... Where is it here? Free to play vote submissions room, and you make you can make a suggestion in there, and then we're gonna start. What I'll do is I'm gonna take all the suggestions. All the suggestions will be entered into votes in in Discord. We're gonna be doing voting starting in April for what we're gonna be doing on the new account. So if you're interested in helping me with the uh, with the account and what we're gonna be doing on that account, go to my Discord, join Discord, link in the video, link in every video I've ever done, link in my channel description. And um, you can also um, go to that room, make a suggestion, and get ready for the voting because the voting is going to drop here in April. We're going to start voting on who you want to see me do on my next free-to-play account. I think there will be. I, I think we're in, it probably. My guess is we won't do a rush account. I won't do a, a, a Galactic Legend rush because I'm going to want to have an early game light side team, a, a early game dark side team. I'm going to make the team roster get both those. And we're going to have an, like an early game meme team that we're going to be going for. So we're going to go for a, a light side, a dark side, and a meme team up front. Then we'll look at, well, what do we do next? Do we do like a ship journey? Do we do a galactic legend journey? Do we do all of that stuff? Do we put it all together and build some core teams? So we're going to, I don't know exactly what we're going to do. We'll, we'll see how that works. See how that works. Anyway, X Zone 5, um, your Omicrons for, for impact would be Malgus and Ben Solo, from what I've seen so far. Malgus and Ben Solo will be your most impactful Omicrons. 
If you're looking at doing the Leviathan next, then, it's, then maybe Malgus. Kersantan, is that Omicron that you can use on your roster? Do you have it? I don't know if you had it or not. So you got some Omicron work to do. Yeah, Kersantan's Omicron is helpful once it gets going. But I think that, um, I think Ben Solo, once you get him geared up, and Malgus are the places you really want Omicrons to get you started. Third sister Omicrons? What is she, the Territory Wars? I don't even know. Reva needs gear. Ben Solo needs gear. Darth Malgus needs gear. Um, are you going for Cal Kestis? Are you trying to get... Did you get Cal Kestis? No, you're so close. You were close, man. Next time. Next time. Reva's Gak? Then maybe... I think Reva may be Omicron's, actually. You got a lot of Omicron work to do. Um, Reva, Ben Solo... And Darth Malgus. You gotta farm Darth Malgus' ship. You're gonna get Jabba done next. Then, then once you get Jabba done, I would start sharding these. Um, get your Jedi Calcasus farm done. Get your Dr. Do Afra farm done. Um, get your... Um, I don't know if you want to do Bo-Katan or, or, or Gungans next. But I would definitely work on Leviathan for sure. But those three characters... Darth Malgus, Ben Solo, and Reva. Probably Reva first, then Darth Malgus, then Ben Solo. If you want to look at transformative characters, I'd go in that order. Reva, Darth Malgus, Ben Solo is what you should do on the roster as far as Omicrons. So there you go. And work on shard your Leviathan while you're finishing up Jabba. And then start sharding for... You got Calcas to start sharding for Dr. Aphra. Let's take a look at these mods. Hmm. Are those all protection? I didn't even look. I was looking at the speed. Nah, you really want to. You really want a speed set here. He might work okay. I just his speed set is better. say and then you got a, like a speed mod mixed in here with him because it's got a bunch of it's got 11 protection i get it and i'm not thrilled with the mods i'm not thrilled with the mods x zone what mod should you mostly farm if you want to farm three sets of mods it would be the ones you most often need in the game it would be speed offense and health those would be the three mod sets i'd be farming most. The other ones you use, uh, critical chance, not as much. Um, that's a good mindset. I would, but I, um, speed, offense, and health would be the ones you use the most on your, on your roster. When going for Lord Vader, kind of accomplish all that, so you see Geos for Padme, Galactic Republic kind of comes up naturally. Also, as interesting, will he go from Levels Leader and Negotiator first? I get it. The thing about Lord Vader is, you know, gas is almost his own galactic legend farm. You gotta farm all of the, the um, separate destroyers, and you gotta go get Grievous, because you gotta have them. You gotta go get the, the Galactic Republic team. Then you gotta go get all the clones. So you really need to farm, like, 14 characters to get to gas and make them work right. Then you gotta get Bad Batch. Onto, it's just a long farm. I'm not saying we're not gonna do it. I'm not even saying we're not going to spend like a year and a half or two years on the next free-to-play account. Maybe we will. Play a little more casual, kind of enjoy ourselves a little bit, you know. But we'll have some fun. I want to do some meme farms. I want to do some early. I want to I do different stuff. My goal on the new account is different stuff. 
not the same old, same old, you know? <clears throat> and I want to do, have, have fun with that. I want you guys to help me have fun with it by voting on it. So, Piet's really too slow here. I don't even know what his speed is, but it's going to be too slow. Yeah, it's not that's pretty fast, actually. You're pretty fast down here. Drops off. Well, it's still 307. Yeah, you, you got... It's weird. I, I feel like your Galactic Legends need speed, but your characters are doing all right. That's okay. I like offense better, but... Tekur to Herniker! A Leviathan Rush. I'm, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I mean, you gotta get to 4 million before you can even think about a Leviathan Rush. A Leviathan Rush would be like... Two years. Minimum. I'm not doing a Leviathan. Um, I think you need to fix your Galactic Legend mods. I think they need some work. But the rest of your mods look pretty good. That's not a great mod. Then you get the, ha having the speed. I don't know. I mean, speed's good for him, but... It's... Let's work on your Galactic Legend mods. That's what I would say, X-Zone. Yeah, get your Jabba, then get Dr. Afra, and um, your Farming Jedi Knight Cal. Get those two done. Marjade's fast. His roster is pretty fast. She's at uh, 355. She's fast. Could use some potency. There it is. That's some potency. I don't want to do the worst characters in the game either, doggies. If you guys vote for it, I will. But I, that would just that wouldn't be fun. And that's just a straight up meme account, and then that's not really my thing. I'm not really the meme guy. AP's the meme guy. I'm not the meme guy. I get AP or Glermit for that. Glermit's kind of um, blowing the coop on us, hasn't he? Where is my Glermit? Anyway, man, that's what you got. Nice roster, dude. Nice roster, X Zone. Get some mods. Fix your mods. All right, Dakota Herdiker. Dekur to Herniker! Nah, I'm not gonna do a Gungan raid rush. By the time I get around to it, um, the raid will be will be gone. If you're doing a free to play account, and you start you start rushing Jar Jar for the raid. By the time you get around to having Jar Jar, the raid's gonna be long gone or on its way out the door. So I just don't like farming for raids. HK2494, undergeared. HK2494, why aren't you at your post? TK421. Dekurter Herniker, you got any comments here, my friend? I just finished C. Now I'm finishing Ray, then I'm thinking Jabba and into Jedi Master Luke. Let me okay, just finish C. Let's take a look. Now finishing Ray. I feel the need, the need for speed. Ow! Just saying. That's all right. Well, guys, I know all the, I hear all the suggestions from you here for what we're going to do with the new account. Go to my Discord. Put the suggestions in the Discord room, and then we're all going to vote. So you are free to campaign in my Discord to vote for your suggestions. So I, I'm going to we'll find a way for you to campaign before. What I might do is like say, okay, the next vote's going to be between these characters. Campaign away and something like that. So, um, yeah, maybe we'll do something like that. All right, so here we go. PS 300 speed. That's not that fast. Your roster is pretty slow. If PS is only 300, this should not be a speed set.
We got a lot of mod work to do here. A lot of mod work. Hang on, let me go check on the boy real quick. Need to go check in my son. <sighs> yeah, you gotta you gotta fix your mods. They're not great. It's your roster's too slow. The roster's too close slow, Dakota Herniker. But what's next? So you're gonna do Ray. Let's take a look at Ray. There's the Radis. Good morning, Yando. How you doing? Are you related to Lando? Yando has followed over on Twitch. Welcome aboard. Thanks for following. All right. Okay, so yeah, you're in good shape for Ray. So Ray is your right path. Thinking Jabba and a Jedi Master. Let me know what you think. Let's take a look here. Relic Newt. That's fun. It would not be a horrible idea for you to finish some farms. Um, I get it. You want to do another Galactic Legend. That's weird. What do you farm these guys up to six stars with canteen energy, then do go to the next one? You like roll it around? I'm like a one character at a time, man. Hi, so welcome to Nooch Nights five minute review. If you'd like your review today, give me your ally code and you'll get your five minute review today, ISO. Um, I guess I'm just overthinking that. I, I would like to see you finish your farms. I, I would like to see that before you do um, go into a Galactic Legend you here again. What you have You've got a tray of teams right, to be finished. Try. You got a no. teams farming finished. They must be. I'd like to see a relic Jolly Bindo. Although if you get Jedi Master Luke, you don't really need that. So maybe, maybe not. You do need a relic bass, Lashawn Fallen, for sure. And just in general, Treya Nihilus Scion would be a, would be a great team to relic. Finish your farm. Yeah, I would take a little bit of time and round out these farms. Chupio. Oh, I saw another one. Did I not? Luke, Han, Creepio, and Chewbacca. Okay. So I would get Chupio relict. Good. Rex is done. Saw Guerrero. Look at that beefy boy. Hold on. No Cal. Saw Guerrero with. What, like Lando? Big. So, Saw Gerrera to your Mon Mothma right now? You went all in on that guy. Tell me that story. They got, um, the for they got Forrest Whitaker looking pretty skinny there, by the way. You're gonna get Cal the last day. Okay, let's look. Seer is seven stars. Cal is year 12. There, that's what I'm looking for. W comes after you. Okay, Tarful.
Marin. Okay, man, you only got what? Three days left? Two days left? You just like Saw? Hey, that's awesome. If you want to get a team to go with Saw, you can talk to my pal, um, Dank Ideals. Saw and like Baze, cheer it. He puts Bodie Rook in there, but whatever. Um, Scare Pathfinder, Biston. Probably put Lando in there. Saw can get holds on defense. Gotcha, Iso. Gotcha, Iso. <clears throat> so you can do Jabba. I'm all on board for Jabba, but I think you should finish these farm. Finish Darth Treya, Nihilus, and Scion. Finish Basilisk, Sean Fallen. Uh, maybe finish Jolie Bindo. Finish Chupio. Finish this team. Grievous, B2, B1, Magnagar, Droidica. You've got, well, you got Newt, so maybe you can skip Droidica, but I would finish that team. You got Newt and B2, Relic. I would get Grievous, B1, and Magnagar done too. You got a nice little team there, man. I would finish some farms and then do Jabba is how I would do this. Because you still need Wampa and you still need Hermit Yoda. Wampa's done, okay. But Hermit Yoda was not done. Yeah, he's still got to get done. So, that's what I would do. That's what I would do. Finish your farms, Jedi Knight Luke, and then Java. And then Ray. Then Ray. Or Ray first, whatever. Ray, finish farms, Jedi Knight Luke, Java. Finish your executor, too. I would definitely. If you're able to hoard some crystals to get Executor 7 stars, it's worth every penny. Worth every penny. Finalizer at 7 stars. Bow to the first order. Hey, good job here. You got this fleet up and running. Well done. I'd love to see a malevolence here with these ships. I would love to see a malevolence there. Just gotta work on your mods for sure. Gotta work on the mods. Because you're pretty slow. That's pretty slow. That's pretty slow. Yeah, you gotta work on it. You need speed on the roster. You need speed. You need speed. Alright. There you go, Decurter Herniker. It's good to see you again, buddy. Alright, Cornelius McCarthy, let's take a look. Cornelius? Cornelius? Name that movie. Is that right? Let me see here. Yeah. I know you guys know the movie. Uh, makes me wonder, would you be willing to do a little roster review or is there a price? Take a look at the uh, Yando. Take a look at the pinned message over there on Twitch. I do about 40 free roster reviews a month, and there are ways to sign up for it. If you want to find, sign up for a free roster review, you can be here for the Kahoot at the beginning of the stream, or you can get on the wheel. Go take a look at the video to learn about that. But we do... We do some of the range of 40 free roster views per month on the channel. Uh, the rest are paid for. Fifth element. Thanks, Sean Johnson. Sean Johnson. Is this the gymnast, Sean Johnson? <laughs> I don't think it is. All right, Corn. Cornelius. Are you here, bud? Valhalla Guardians. Point five million. Tony Shaw, what another another Masters member has shown up today. There he is, Jedi Knight Cal. Nice. All the Jedi they killed, they sure left a lot of them alive. 
Looking sharp, man. Looking sharp. Let me see something. I thought I saw something else. So, you got Darth Malgus, Jedi Knight Cal. I assume Starkiller's in here. This is a weird roster, man. That's funny, Sean. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Where's Akbar? Akbar come in the show. I guess Akbar was not in the Shadows of the Empire bundle. I thought he was. Where's Akbar? There he is. It's a trap. All right. So we went over the Leia seven months ago. I don't remember seven months ago, man. So you get to take your beating again. <laughs> I guess maybe you had her at the beginning and put the Omicron on and then regretted it. I mean, you got some of the early Omicrons on here. First Order Tide Pilot, Princess Leia, Captain Phasma, Darth Talon, Kyle Katarn. I don't even know what that does. Finn. Finn is good now if you have Zori. Everything's great, Fruit Lunch. Roger, Roger. Welcome to Newt's Nights. Give me in your LA code and you'll get that five-minute review. I'm trying to figure out the roster, man. What are we going to do here? Did I write anything down? No. Well. <clears throat> yeah, you did, E-Man. Joe Correa came on and gifted some memberships. A lot of random stuff geared up in here. And then Commander Soka is down here. Cornelius, your your roster perplexes me, man. Neither one of these fleets are complete, but you've got the you got the bad batch like all farmed. Got a gear twelve hunter. I'm really confused, man. I don't know what to tell you. Um Jet. I can hold it. Pull up! No, I'm all right. What's up, bud? Wow. That fun rehearsal. What time does it start? <laughs> All right, get it moving. We'll see you in a bit. See you later tonight. 
Do it. That's good. Okay. See you, bud. Have a good day. Love you. Bow to the first order. I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. This roster. Um, there's so much that needs to be finished. I mean, Cornelius, what are what are you thinking? What are what are your thoughts? You haven't really said anything. I got executor. We talked about Leia Seven, but what are your thoughts? What are you what are you going for? What are you trying for? Jedi Knight Luke is done. Is not Jedi Master Luke Ray need gas and all the Sith Empire besides Malak and Malgus. What? It doesn't. You have all the Sith Empire? No, there's Mal. Oh, you're right. Besides Mal, dude, dude. How close are you to Malgus's Fury Class Interceptor? I've defined it all the time, Girl of Grove. I say Relic 3 is a finished character. We talk about it all the time. All right. Um, I mean... Yeah, guys, there's just FYF all over the place. And I... Not. You're not close to it. How? Well, I mean, it's not proving grounds. I'm not close at all. This roster is kind of filthy with FYF. It, it just, it's all over the place, man. I, I don't know another way to put it. You must unlearn. What you have learned. All right, I'll give it a try. No, try not. Teams, farming, finished. They must be. I mean, I know you want to do Ray, and I know you want to do um. Did I master Luke? But I. Let's get those two done, and then let's let's hold off. So you've only got one Galactic Legend. I get okay. I I. Well, you threw me for a loop here, man. This roster threw me for a loop. Okay. So look. You you can do Ray soon. Ray and then Jedi Match Luke is not far away. So let's get them done. Let's get you a couple more Galactic Legends, okay? But then I want you to finish your farms. We're gonna talk about Bast Lashon. We're gonna let's talk about the Sith Empire. You need to finish the Sith Empire team. You need to get Bastia Sean Fallen, Darth Revan, and one of these three up and running. And that'll give you a full team. I don't care which one. You're going to need them all eventually. Sith Marauder, you need for a Sith. Sith Marauder goes a few places. So these, finish these two, and then one of, one of these three. Get them relic, okay? Then if you look at your old Republic, you know, Jolie Bendo is kind of like, but if you're going to go for Jedi Master Luke, you may not need him as much. So I wouldn't worry about that as much. Then if we look at... What else are we looking at, man? Um, you need Jedi Master Luke to, for Cal Kestis to really work. Starkiller needs to be done. you got to get Starkiller done. He's got to be at your at the, like, the top of your list to get done. Cal Kestis and Marin. Cal Kestis to go with your Jedi... Uh, oh, excuse me, your Ray team? What about Ben Solo? No Ben Solo yet. So Cal Kestis on that Ray team makes a difference for sure. And, um, 
Heck, you got Marin. You got an Omicron on her. You got a Zeta on her. Why not get your Night Sisters up and running so you can do an Assault Battle and you can use them in Grand Arena. So I would do... After you get all that, I'd do Mother Talzin, Old Daka, and Asajj as well. Get these top five going on the team. That's the stuff I'd work on immediately. That would be the stuff... And then... So... Ray, Jedi Master Luke, get those farms finished. I mean, you're kind of slowly farming Lord Vader, too. Um, and I would also, on your ships, finish your Separatist fleet. Get these, both of these ships, three, get all three of these ships to seven stars. Make that ship, that fleet finished. Your Galactic Republic fleet. Get your Y-Wing, get Anakin ship. Farm those ships, they're really, really important. They make those fleets really go. Make them awesome. Get all of your Bad Batch you need here to gear 12. Get um, Tech to gear 12. Get Wrecker to gear 12. You know, if you got the Marauder, you got 7 stars. You got Hunter, gear 12. Get them all to gear 12. Make that really work. First order. Bow to the first order. Get your TIE Echelon to 7 stars. You know, make that work for you as well. Get your Executors 7 stars as fast as you can. Save some Crystals. Get to 7 stars. So those are the things I'd be working on. You can get your Galactic Legends, that's great, but do the farm, the finishing your farms too along the way. Make your make yourself some really good teams down here at the bottom. Your Imperial Troopers. Man, um, relic up your Dark Trooper. Uh, and get, you know, get get teams for both these guys. You can get a Gear 12 Stark or Relic Stark, Relic Dark Trooper. You can get Veers as okay where he is. Gideon, get him up. Get an Iden Versio team with Death Trooper, Range. If you get a, a 12, Gear 12 Iden Versio team, that's something to contend with on defense in Grand Arena. So I would say finish those farms, and you move, then you can do the two Galactic Legends, then finish your farms, okay? Let's take a look at your mods. See, I don't like a crit damage set here. I want to see a speed set. He's really, really slow. I mean, not really, really slow, but he's slow. He's slow compared to other Kylos. He's like 70 slower than a typical Kylo. So I'd work on finishing, you know, get his, fix your mods, fix your Kylo mods. Let's look at Mara Jade. Three eleven. she's slow too. You need more speed. You need more speed on the roster. It's really, you know, you're missing a lot of speed as well. I feel the need, the need for speed. Ow! You always miss the GAC lineups, so you're super low. Oh, no. Well, that's not good. Don't miss the GAC uh, signups. Sign up for GAC, man. Anyway, that's what you got to work on the roster. You need a bunch of speed mods. You need Ray. You need um, Jedi Master Luke. You need to finish off your um, farms that you got here. Put some characters in some good, productive places and make some things happen on the roster. That's it. I mean, you got a nice little base here. You got a lot to work from, but that's the stuff you got to work on. All right, Limitless. Let's take a look at this thing. TTV Empanada! Ugh. Trekkies? What? You're in the wrong game, my friend. Trekkies? You in the wrong game. Empanada. Limitless, are you here? Say something. Speak up, my friend. All right. Um, finish your Kylo. Obviously, that's the first thing you'll be working on. You know it. I know it. Everybody knows it. Finish your Kylo. Tell me what I'm doing wrong. Uh oh. Doors have been opened. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what I'm doing wrong. Oh boy. Are you ready? I didn't mean to click on that. Well, you bought every bundle.
Looks like you're right around the corner from Executor. I think your Malevolence fleet looks good. Let's take a look. Yeah. <coughs> no, not that one. Bow to the first order! Um, so one thing you're doing wrong is... You need to farm Special Forces TIE Fighter and the um, um, uh, TIE Echelon so that when you get a 7-star finalizer, you can counter Executive. So that's one thing you're doing. So get that fixed. Finish Kylo. Obviously, that's your biggest priority right now is finishing Kylo. Yeah, the Huxeda? I would think so. If you got Kylo, you had to have had it. Yeah. Hmm. See, you bought all these bundles. <sighs> Need to farm this guy. Captain Rex needs to be a priority. Even though I know in a few months he's going to be a double drop, I, you just got to get him here. Anybody, I would just refer you to my Lightspeed Bundle Farming Guide. Go take a look at that. That'll help you out. Since you purchased all these Lightspeed Bundles, I'm going to point you to that Farming Guide, and I'm not going to... So go take a look at the Lightspeed Bundle Farming Guide um, on YouTube. That'll be a big help to you. So that's your first step, is take a look at that. Um, but what else besides that? So you got to finish Kylo. you got to finish Ray. No Radis. No, there's Radis. Okay. So Kylo and then Ray. <sighs> Kylo, Ray. Kylo's finishing your gearing and ultimate. Ray is a, a complete. Finish it up. Do it. Do it. Um, Captain Rex, and then your CLS team. CLS, 3PO, Han, Chewbacca, Chupio. I gotta finish those. Gotta finish those. And then... Uh-oh. I saw something that bothered me. It will bother me here in a minute. All right, so Executor's going to be here pretty soon. You'll have Executor very soon. Why are you grinding C? You've, you've got Ray sitting right in front of you. Why are you grinding C? Just finish Ray. That's what you're doing wrong. You buy the light speed bundles and you're just sitting on them and doing nothing with them. Finish Ray. Why are you doing C? That, 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 that. That's still got to get more on it. Um. That, that. This is ugly. That is just, Darth Revan is ugly. I don't, I don't understand the C. I don't know why you're grinding for C. You have six grinds. Yeah, that's a problem. You can't. Your grinds are limitless. You have limitless grinds going on. Hmm. 
Hmm. I knew it was coming, but there it is. Wow. All right, boys and girls, I want you to get your notepads out. I'm about to say something deep and profound. <clears throat> this roster has led me to a deep and profound message here. There's there's just, there, there's a Jedi Knight Revan team unfinished, a Darth Revan team unfinished, a CLS team unfinished. He's got the Ray bundle. He's got the Rebel bundle. He hasn't farmed Captain Rex yet. He's grinding for Sith Eternal. Um, he's got to finish Kylo here. His ships need to get some stuff finished for Executor. You know, you can't farm everything and get everyone, but you can farm everything and get no one, and that's your problem. You're farming everything and getting no one. You need to pick one thing and farm that one thing and get that one thing. Then you pick the one thing and you farm the next thing and you get that second thing. And you can be farming in the background. You're always farming in the background, but pick one thing and finish it and then do the next thing, but you can't farm Ray and Sith Eternal and Executor and the CLS team and the Revens and the Revens and whatever else you're farming. Jedi Knight Luke, Jedi Master Luke. You can't just do all, Captain Rex. Just too much farming going on. You need to stop, step back, and finish some stuff. Okay, Limitless? So let's limit, let's limit your farms right now. The very first thing you're going to do is you're going to finish Executor. Number one, finish Executor. Get it done. You got to get that done, okay? The Sith Eternal farm right now is, is not the priority. Your priority is to finish Kylo and then finish Rey, okay? Those are your top two priorities. Kylo is going to be done, and then do your Rey farm resistance. So, Executor and then Ray. Executor and then Ray, and then the full CLS team. Executor, then Ray, then the full CLS team. And then I want you to, you can finish C then if you'd like, but I'd like you to go, you've got the Revens, let's go finish the Revens. Let's go do those Revens. You're probably closer to C than you are to Revens though, unfortunately. So I would say, um, Executor, Ray, CLS. And then you can do your, then do your Sith Eternal farm. And then do your Revens. In that order. That's what you're going to do, okay? Executor, Ray, Sith Eternal, CLS, CLS, Sith Eternal, whatever. And then what did I say? Uh, and you're going to, you need to finish off Dark Trooper for your Veers team. You got Veers, Stark, Piet, Dark Trooper, and you need, you can put, I guess, Stormtrooper or somebody in there, whatever. You can even put Iden Versio in there. Get yourself a nice trooper team. Because you're going to relic all those guys for Sith Eternal and, and Executor. So, then you're going to go get Jedi Knight Luke and Jedi Master Luke. You need to do Captain Rex in the middle of all that, too. Get Captain Rex done as well. And that's your farming path. Finish, uh, farm the Thai Echelon every day. So it's when you get a 7-star finalizer. You're good. If a Thai Echelon and Special Forces TIE Fighter, get those done. And that'll be nice for you. Now, let's take a look at some mods. You can't really have Kylo modded properly yet. I mean, it's the right idea. But let's see who your next fastest is. Yeah, you gotta limit yourself, man. It's just too much.
so... I feel the need. The need for speed. Ow! It's Mary J. Stop roasting it and review it. It's been hard. It's hard. There's so much going on. It's really hard to narrow down. And hello there to uh, Rebel RX. What's up? It's hard to narrow it down and, and review it. I am reviewing it. You no, know, roasting it is reviewing it. I hate to tell you. Roasting is reviewing. So when you look at it, and I'm looking at everything, it's, but it's really hard when somebody has has just got all this stuff farmed and not finished. Like, none of this is finished. It's all just kind of lingering out there, you know? So it just kind of makes it... I'm just back from vacation. I'm trying to get things sorted out. So, you know, it's just different. So... That's your path. You need a lot of speed mods. You need a lot of speed on the roster. You're missing a lot of speed. Definitely farm your mods for sure. You need a lot more health here. Um, you, offense is not the way to go. You want to get a bunch of health. She stacks all the offense. I mean, this is... You got a good speed on Wampa. You're probably using her even at gear 12. Is she gear 12? No, she's relic. Okay. That's a lot of good speed on Wampa. That's a good thing. Starkiller is looking pretty good. You got some decent mods, but you need more speed at the top of your roster for sure. So keep working on it. But you, yeah, one at a time. Executor, Ray, CLS team, Sith Eternal, Captain Rex somewhere along the way. Get your Revens done. That's stuff you got to do on this roster. That's stuff you got to do on the roster. There you go. All right, Limitless. Let me know if you can limit yourself, okay? All right, the one. All right, I'm gonna, we're going to say we're full. There you go. All right, guys. We're going to be full. We're at two hours. I still got a bunch of reviews to do. Probably going to save the wheel spins. I think I'm going to do several videos this week of wheel spin reviews for everybody. So there's the one. Let's take a look here. JB King. I'm Jubba King. E, B, D, B, B, and B. There's a lot of vowels missing uh, in general up here at the top. We have a lot of vowels. I realize these are probably your initials. But it looks like Jabiking or some version of joking. And this is E, B, D, B, B, and B. I mean, it's just a, we're just missing some vowels and words. That's, that's all. That's my first observation. That's my first observation. All right, we got Kylo here. So, all right, again, same thing. Finish Tyashlan, you know, once you get final finalizers of seven stars, it matters. So we're going for Negotiator. We got Radis. Hey, Eli, middle G. I'm focusing on Gas and the Quizzers, Jedi Counts. All right, all right, take a look. Definitely need to step up this fleet a little bit. Um, you know, get, get Anakin at least to gear 12. You know, if you can relic him, great. But at least gear 12. That That's good. Flo Koon's okay. Again, gear 12 would be nice. Um, this, this You need this Y-Wing. Because you probably ran it with with uh, Hounds 2 for a little bit. You're going to get Executor here pretty soon. So you need that Y-Wing. Marauder's a good farm too. Working on executor, kind of. Let's see here. Oh, not working on executor at all. No tie bomber. No tie bomber. Ah, oh, that hurts. That hurts my soul. You got four. You had a four star tie defender and no tie bomber. 
I would definitely be farming Thai, the Thai Bomber, man. I would definitely be farming Thai Bomber. I'm sure the Holdo Kron is nuts. I'm, I'm looking forward to getting it. <sighs> so you're focusing on gas and inquisitors with Jedi Cal on the side. We got to get Ray's ultimate. I'm sure you're working on that. One, two. You got gas. Okay. Gas is six stars. So uh, you got to do these guys. You can't just do gas. You got to do fives, Rex, Echo, and Arc Trooper as well. That's what I always say about gas. It's it's a fourteen character farm. It's not a it's not a simple farm. So if you're gonna get gas, you got to do those guys. Wait till I get three thirty ten before I activate him. Who? Gas? You already got him activated. What? What? Three thirty before I activate who? I'm confused. Hey, uh, get these four guys going. You got to get all the all four. This this team's got to be there. Oh, the Thai bomber. Okay, that's an it. It's an it. Uh, let's see here. Be nice to the man. He's just not very good at Wheel of Fortune. She, they, what? I don't know what's happening here. Wheel of Fortune. What? What's happening? I don't know what's going on over on Twitch. Conversations I can't deduce. Oh, we're not going to Wheel of Fortune because the vowels are missing. Ah, I get it. I get it. We'll get that TIE Bomber up and running. And in Inquisitors, huh? Pretty far there. I mean... Why are you doing Inquisitors right now? Is your guild forcing you to? Because that's foolish of them. You don't have... You need to get Starkiller up. Starkiller? Your CLS team is, is nothing? Why are you doing Inquisitors? This roster doesn't appear to be ready for Inquisitors to me. I could be wrong. But this does not look like an Inquisitor-ready roster to me. Like, you got an unfinished Jedi Knight Revan team. You got an unfinished Dark Trio team. You got an unfinished Padme team. Unfinished Grievous. Unfinished Wampa. Unfinished Gas. Unfinished Darth Revan. Unfinished Savage Press. Unfinished CLS team. Unfinished Full Grievous team. I mean... I'm finished Star Killer. You got so much to work on here, and you're going for Inquisitors? They're not nice to have. No, if your guild doesn't need them, then they're not nice to have. They're not a great team without Reva. So, if your guild's not doing Inquisitors, skip it and finish all those farms. Got a lot of FYF today, you know? You must unlearn what you have learned. Alright, I'll give it a try. No! Try not! Teams. Farming. Finished, they must be. If your guild is not doing Rise of the Empire and doing Reva shards, then the Inquisitors are just like, just stuff on your roster that does okay in a few places. They do the Assault Battle, I'll give you that one. In the Assault Battle, they're really important. Other than that... So if you want to get them for the Assault Battle, fine, but you're not close. You're really not close. And... You've already got Genetic Revan done. You've already got Dark Treya done. Padme, Grievous, Wampa, Gas, who needs the 500 first. Darth Revan, Savage Opress, uh, GK, Han Solo, Grievous as well. I mean, I think you need to finish your farm. Starkiller. Look, when you farm these types of characters and you get them to seven stars, 
He need to finish the team. And again, finish means take him to Relic 3 at least. Okay? So... Alright. Celeste, Chewbacca, 3PO, Han Solo, Chupio. It's just too good of a team to, to leave it like this. They're just too good to leave them like this. You need to finish. You'll, you'll thank me later. Trust me. Again, we go back to Phoenix. Captain Rex does too much for this team to leave it where it is. You got the, you got the Omicron and Hera. You get Captain Rex up and running with his Zeta. And man, that's a great team for defense and territory wars. Um, Jedi Knight Revan team is great for you. The Dark Trade team is great for you. What about Savage? Where's he? There's Savage. He's got an Omicron, but you need to finish him up. Here's your farming order. Ray Ultimate. Finish your farms. CLS first. Then Genonite Revan, then Dartrea team, then your Grievous Separatists. And along the way, you'll get your Gas 501st up and running. You should probably do, um, you should probably gear the 501st and C 501st and CLS are the first two things you get geared up. Wampa is somewhere in there. Then you do the Revans. Um, you're going to do your Grievous team. You're going to get, you're going to start farming. You're going to shard for Captain Rex. You're not going to do Inquisitors. We're not ready for Inqui Inquisitors. Aren't, you, you Unless you're just desperate to get Inquisitors on your roster, they're not really going to help you much. For the Galactic Republic, you're going to start farming the Y-Wing and um, and get Anakin up to at least gear 12 for that fleet. And get the tie. And then in the background, you're going to be going TIE Bomber and getting ready for Executor in the background. That's what you should do. That would be the best way to do it. Arise and Gondolin has arrived! Oh, come on. I literally watched that movie last two nights ago. Two Towers. We watched Two Towers, me and uh, my buddy Cosmo. And we watched the extended version and we did not have four hours. So we skipped through a lot of the Frodo and Sam stuff because there's some snooze fest there. But we had fun. We had fun watching it. Um... Yeah, finish your farms, man. So finish up Ray, and then we'll do all that other stuff. Don't don't do Inquisitors. You got too much. There's too much potential sitting here. There's too much untapped potential sitting here to go work on Inquisitors. By the way, you're probably going to be in a video, the one. Sorry. <laughs> Nothing personal. Not a short, a video. But, yeah, there's just too much potential here for what you could have this roster be. Finish the farms. Gas, CLS, Revens, Wampa. I mean, we talked about it. Just get it all done. Treya, Savage, Grievous team. And, and work, and you'll be, by then you'll get to the executor. But I would not, you're not ready for... Unless your guild desperately needs an Inquisitor's team right now, you're so far from that. And it costs so many Kyratex. Just get those other, get those other teams. These other teams are better than the Inquisitors. For real. Most of them. They're better teams than the Inquisitors in almost every game mode. The Inquisitors get you assault battles. I get it. But so does a Relic CLS team. Um, you know, so does a, a Relic Phoenix team. They'll get you another, you know, it's the Secrets and Shadows. Starkiller, you gotta finish that guy, man. You gotta finish him, so... That's my advice here. Let's take a look at some mods. <clears throat> Why does everybody have health here? This should be offense. Stop putting health here, people. It's okay. It's not. It's it's not that fast. Again, man, we get a lot of, a lot of the same same things over and over. I feel the need. The need for speed. Ow! You know, um... That's really slow for Mara. And that should be a potency cross. Not potency on her. 
Yeah, uh, you got to get Mara faster. You need to work on speed in general. Um, there you go. Get some more speed mods. Get some more mods on the on the roster. Just hammer those mods. You were moving mods yesterday. I think you said your mods have been have been a work in progress. You need so I get it. I get it. Your mods are challenging right now. They are for everybody, and, and it takes a lot of work. So there you go. There you go. All righty. Let's look at the next one here. All right, we're on some five-minute reviews right now. Eyebones Brigade is up first. Let's alert the timer. What's this? Aha! Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Eyebones, are you here? Give me a comment now, because once the timer starts, I'm off and running. I often say these five-minute reviews might even be better than the full reviews, just because, you know, I, I just dial in instead of wandering around. Hang on one second. Blazer, not lawless. Interesting. Okay, let me get the timer going. And away we uh, go. So we got Leia and Leviathan here. Kyber too, huh? Let's look at the roster here, Eyebones. We got five minutes to look at everything. I feel like you've got... Wow, Executor, Leviathan. No profundity yet. We got uh, like a light malevolence. Let's look at that fleet. That fleet's complete, so once you get the malevolence done, it'll be in good shape. Let's look at the Galactic Republic Negotiator there. This is complete. I would definitely try to get your Bad Batch to gear 12. I think that's the way to go with these three. I know there's Kyrotex involved, but getting them to gear 12 will make this ship work, you know, so much better for you than it is right now. You're probably not even using it right now, you know what I mean? Um, three, four Galactic, five Galactic Legends. We got Sith Eternal, or we got, okay, no Sith Eternal, yeah, I, just, I meant uh, Darth Revan. Let's scroll down here. I saw, I saw Cal Kestis up there. Do you have Jedi Cal? Do, 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 do. There's Jedi Cal Kestis to go with your Jedi Master Luke. Are you happy? Did you just get him? I'm, you probably just got him here recently. So does that make you happy, Eye Bones? Hopefully that Jedi Cal is going to really transform your, your Luke team here. Um, protection is, is kind of protection missing here. Speed, protection, protection. That's all right. Okay. I like this being a protection mod if you can find a good... Protection primary, or excuse me, yeah, protection primary with some speed on it, but you got like seven and a half percent protection there on him, so that's okay. Everybody waited long for Cal Kestis, so let's see what we got. Now you're you're in um, Hyper Two. Data grounds right, right? You need to pick these up a little bit. These new data grounds are kind of lacking. You're probably just making your way through conquest still at the moment. All right. So let's look more at these galette at these. I don't know if you need a lot of help right now, right? Jabba, Luke, Leia. Well, where's Profundity? Profundity fills in your other like five-way farming here. What am I looking at? Rogue One. Okay, you're working on Profundity, I think. Yes, yes, yes. So Profundity being next up. Excellent. So you're not need a lot of farming help. You know what you're going for. You know what you're working on. What is next, just for fun? Wow, Sith Eternal is a way off. Maybe a bundle for him soon. 69 cup, congratulations. Dur, 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 dur. Imperial Troopers probably could use a little uh, step up there. I mean, you got uh, Piet, and v Piet and Scout Trooper, and then nothing. You're not using these troopers for anything. I love the troopers so much. It's unfortunate. Probably Lord Vader if it's a GL. I mean, that makes sense. You already got Leia and you already got Jabba, so he'll be up and running. I like it. What about Kenobi? I mean, you're probably not very far from Kenobi at all. I bet you're really close. Grievous is done. Magna Guard's done. Uh, what? You only have a five? How do you have a five-star Watt on this roster? How is that even possible? <clears throat> How is that even possible to have a five-star Watt on the roster? I just don't get it. Wow. I'm amazed. This looks like it's ready for Jedi Master Kenobi, except for that part. Now let's look at the speed. Let's look at everybody here. 
Kylo's modded for speed, crit damage, offense. There you go. That's a that's a decent mod set. That's a decent mod set. You're not overly concerned with that right now. Uh, with what? What did I say? I don't even know what I said. Uh, there's Mara Jade. She's modded for speed and potency and nice speed. You're doing good. I mean, you're in Kyber too. You're not going to have garbage speed on here. Especially without any any uh, data crons, really. You gotta have some good speed. Permit Yoda is at 283. It's a little slow, but I know you're working on it here right now. I did enjoy my days off, Don M. So let's take a look here. So you're you're looking at Lord Vader next. IKEA, what's up? Um Man, I wish you had a seven star watt. I feel like you should. I mean, Bad Batch are there. You probably got a lot of other stuff kind of almost done for her, for him. Five, Relic 5, just a few more Relics there. Padme is Relic 5. Yeah, so you're not really that far off from Lord Vader either. I love the I love the Lord Vader idea. Let's see here. What am I looking for? Online Force, do you have Maul? There's Maul, so you can use Maul. Okay. I like the Lord Vader idea on this roster. I also would like maybe... Um, do you have Afra? Nope. Um, I like the Afra farm, you know? I mean, at, at the stage of the game you're at, like, Afra makes sense. You got Jedi Knight Cal, but Afra would make sense. And, um, I'd like to see her. I'd like to see her troopers get a little bit better. I'd love to see a seven-star Watt Tambor, and there we go. That wraps us up for today. Um... Nice roster, dude. It's nice roster. Well done. Good job. I can see why you're in Kyber too. I'm working on Bane, E man. I'm working on him. All right. Um, ISO, let's take a look. Are you still here? Did Roger Roger give an ally code? I kind of messed up my screens here a little bit. Did Roger, Roger, did you give an ally code, Roger, Roger? I don't see it. If I missed it. Maybe Roger, Roger didn't want to review? But welcome to it either way. By the way, for our Knights of Nooch members, even for our Masters members, you know, we have a spreadsheet to fill out where I'm using that to make roster review videos. So if you're interested, um, let's see here. Darth Bane C is a monster team. Yes, that it is. That it is. All right. Uh, da, 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 da. Farming Jedi Master League, but I don't know what to do next. Okay. I can give you what I think. Well, well I, I would need to get it from Roger Roger. Did he type it, Ash? Oh, cute. That's here. Hilarious. Nice. Nice, Ash. Um, We got five minutes here for ISO. He's going for Jedi Master Luke and then doesn't know what to do next. I see. I see, Ash. And away we go. Okay, so we got Spring Leader Kylo Ren. We got Ray. Uh, we got Gas. I mean, we've got a nice roster here. Look at that 500 first. They're finished and complete. Um, What's next up here? We got going for Jedi Master Luke, but what's next? So where are you on the Jedi Master Luke train here? Let's take a look real quick. You got Leia. So you got a nice little Phoenix. I would I would finish off your Phoenix team if I was looking at this right now. Um, make the Phoenix better. You know, you got Captain Rex. Get Captain Rex. The Omicron here. I was, oh, it's almost like you did the wrong Zeta. 
get Captain Rex the Omicron, then get some Zetas on Hera, Sabine, Kanan. Really make that team work for you is what I would say with Captain with the Phoenix. I would make that Phoenix team better. Um, and get Hera's Omicron for TW. That's something you could work on for sure. You got Star Killer done up there. I saw that. Uh, what's oh a nice Imperial Super Command on Gar Saxon. Just take him to Relic Three. Why not? Yeah, we're on Twitch and YouTube. We're on Twitch and YouTube, guys. Nooch too good on Twitch and YouTube. Go take a look. Um, what's next? Let me see something here. Watt is done. Commander Ahsoka is there. I think Jedi Master Kenobi's next. That's what I would go for. You got all this stuff farmed. I would do Jedi Master Kenobi next. Seems like a makes sense type of deal. You're not that far. You're not that far from Jedi Master Kenobi. I would. That's what I would be doing next. For sure. For sure. Now, let's look at this. Jedi Master Luke. Now, what about uh, Jabba? Not really working on Jabba. What about the Profundity? Or do you have the... I didn't see if you have the Executor. Okay, Executor's six stars. What about Profundity? Uh, yeah. I would be farming Radis every day. I'd be farming Radis every day so that you're ready for the Profundity when you're ready, when you want to get it done. So farm Radis every day to get that Profundity done. But I think Jedi Master Kenobi is your best bet. Where's Leia? I thought you had Leia. Oh, she's only Relic 4 and no... No ultimate yet and only two Zetas. Okay, so you're working on Leia. Okay. Farm Radis so you can do a profundity down the road. Go get yourself Jedi Master Kenobi now. You're ready for him. You're just ready for a Jedi Master Kenobi push there. It's very simple. Now, you're probably in a guild that will want you to do Inquisitors, so I'd start thinking about farming these guys. Um, you'll need a lot of Cantina energy, but I would really start focusing on getting these guys done. You're probably in a guild doing Rise of the Empire territory battles, so let's see if we can get the Inquisitors kind of on the map as well for you. Once you get Jedi Master Luke and Jedi Master Kenobi done, that's what I would probably be pivoting toward. Farming Jabba in the background, or maybe going to get like a Dr. Afra farm done or something. On the roster, that would make a lot of sense. Your guild gets 45 Reva shards. Well, then when you get Reva, wouldn't you want a team to go with her? You see what I'm saying? Like, if you get Reva, so you've got you've been there two months. So at 45, 90 out of 130. Um, two more months, 180, four months, 270. So six months. In six months, I think you could you easily have Jedi Master Kenobi done in a couple of months. Easily. He's right there for the picking, okay? Jedi Master Kenobi, easy. Um, what was the other one we said? Jedi Master Luke, you're working on? I, I just think when you get Reva, you want to have the Inquisitors and Grand Inquisitor on the roster to use them. So I would say Inquisitors is your next farm because you want to be able to use your Reva. Let's take a look at these mods real quick. So you don't want health there. You want crit damage here on that. If it'll, I, I go down to like even 10 speed just to get a crit damage mod there for sure. For sure. Working on Leia's ult. Oh, Bosk is your next fastest, huh? Butters! At 3.30, that is a fast boss. Holy cow, dude. Wow, that's a fast boss with not very much protection. Get a bunch of protection on Bosk. You want a bunch of protection. Look. His leadership ability gives everybody 50% max protection, then they recover it whenever they try to land a debuff. Protection, protection, protection on Bosk. Nice roster, man. Let us know what you do and what you decide to do. Roger Roger has not piped up yet with uh, an ally code. So, so, hold on a minute. I think we're going to spin the wheel a couple times here. Let's spin that wheel. Time to spin for some ROM. I'm gonna spin this twice. Oh, what's with my screen? Butters! What's up, man? It's good to see you. All right, so let me open the room here. 
Sorry I'm snorting today, guys. That's gross. By the way, I'm watching Afterlife with Ricky Gervais, and holy cow, what an amazing show. I think of it because he goes to a yoga studio at one point, and the guy leading the yoga, the yoga studio is doing that. <laughs> the whole time. It's hilarious. It's supposed to be out quiet and meditating, and he's just snorting the whole thing. All right, let's spin this wheel right now. Let's see what we get. We're going to spin a couple of these. Just going to spin a couple. First one is CJ Perkins Boy. That's a new name. Take him off. So I guess CJ Perkins is, is his dad. If you want to get your name on the wheel, see the pinned message. There's a video link in there that tells you all about the wheel. Cook Niner, I think we did him this month. I feel like Cook Niner got a review this month. I could be wrong about that. I don't see him on the list. I feel like he either won a Kahoot. Let me see here. Um, ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Maybe we didn't. Hold on. Nope, I guess not. I don't see the name. So that's going to be Cook Niner, baby. All right. Cook Niner is a Twitch guy, by the way. All right, let's jump in here. Let's jump in here. Roger, Roger did respond. Roger, Roger, are you here? Let's do Roger Rogers before we go to this. All right, I got you, Roger Roger. Yeah, I just never saw the message, man. Sorry, sorry I missed that, but I'm glad some folks keyed in there. Thank you to uh, Dragon, and thank you to Don M for letting me know. Thank you. All right. I don't know. I can't see it. Can I not see it? I never saw it. Did you not put the X's in there? That's why I didn't see it, probably. All right, Roger Roger. It's a timed review. Let's get this thing rolling. You got any any last requests before we go in? I'm going to give you a minute to make some requests. <laughs> All good. Only playing seven months total returning player. Okay, here we go. Seven months total. We got Kylo in there. Thank you. Lightspeed bundles. Is it going? Start. Oh my goodness, it wasn't going. Here we go. All right, we got uh, we got Kylo here. Needs his ultimate still. What about what his mods? Let's take a look at his mods. Is it, the guild was called Sequel Sucks? Nice. Offense. Offense. Okay, got to work on some speed there, but you've only been playing for seven months, so I get it. You're working on it. You're working on it. We got Jenna Knight Revan. We got Jolie Bindo. We got Darth Vader. We got all the Kylos, of course. We got Darth Revan. Nice. I like it, Savage. We got all the bundles purchased. We got, do we have resistance? We have resistance bundles purchased. Take a look at our ships. We got the finalizer. We got the radis. All right. So this gives me a good idea where I, I love your side farms. I love the finished side farms. Let's take a look at these things. I love it. Jedi Knight Revan, uh, uh, Yoda, Basilisk John, Jolie Bendo. Thumbs up, man. 
Add some more relic levels. Get these guys to at least relic three. That'll be great on your roster. Nice. Let's look at the Sith Empire. Good job. Good job. Get another Zeta on Darth Revan, and you and you get your Zetas on Darth Malak. This would be a great three-person team. Even I even used this three-person team in five v five when I had it all the time. This three people in five v five could do a lot of damage. Sith Empire Trooper, Sith Marauder. You can go with HK Gear Twelve. I wouldn't gear him up anymore. I can see with your Gear Twelves, it looks like you're saving gear. Let's see here. Eh, maybe not. Be careful about just throwing random gear. Like Zalbar, I guess maybe you wanted to get him up to his the power he needed him at. So be careful about throwing on random gear on Gear Twelve characters. You kind of just want to not give him any extra gear unless they need it. Okay. All right. So I already see that you're gonna get Ray. So Ray is gonna be important to get on the roster because you've got the Radus almost almost at four stars. I clicked on the wrong thing there. You're trying to finish CLS, Jedi, Luke, Sith, Trio, Empire Farm. You got, you're got, you doing it right. You're doing it right. Let's talk about that then. So, Ray will be after that. So, yes. CLS. Get your CLS team. Captain Rex done. Right there. You're working on it. I can see it. What about what about your Ewoks? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, boy. Ewoks need some work. Chirpa, Elder, Low Gray is a fight. Low Gray and Pablo are easy to finish. Wicket, you can finish to seven stars. Just start. I would be farming Wicket every day and getting Low Gray and Pablo with your Mark I raid currency, but start farming Wicket every day of your life. Um, you can do Nisa too, you know, so there you go. Uh, I can see C-Rex is almost done there. I love your idea. Uh, CLS, Jedi Knight Luke. Oh, Jedi Knight Luke, huh? Let's do this. Wampa's there. Uh, I don't have Hermit, Hermit Yoda yet. I like the idea of Jedi Knight Luke. I've always said that the Shadows of the Empire bundle is really a Jedi Master Luke bundle. Where is it? Where'd it go? I like your Sith trio. And what was the other thing you're working on? I like your I like your path. You're doing a good job. You're on the right. You got the right idea about things. You said Empire. Let's see here. So you're working on your troopers. You're working on like a Palpatine team. Palpatine, Vader, Mara Jade. Good, 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 good. Now let's go look at those ships. Let's look at the bounty hunters. Okay, okay. Now let's look at your TIE Bomber. Thank you. Okay. So Executor's not that far down the road for you either. So you got Executor Farming. You're working on CLS. You're working on your Jedi Knight Revan. You got a little Empire team up here uh, getting work on it. Piet's got to get got to get done for uh, the Executor, obviously. To to uh, to go with Piet, I like, I like Troopers. I like Veers. I like Stark. I like Dark Trooper. I like Gideon. I like Range Trooper. Um, you know, those are teams I like to go with Piet. I think Piet really maximizes potential on your roster. He'll fit on your Darth Vader team. You know, Palp, Mara Jade, Darth Vader, Piet, Tar Tarkin. That'll be an okay team for a while. It'll be a good team for a while, but work on those Imperial Troopers to get a real good team. But I like the idea of you finishing your farms and work on that. Let's look at your speed. I love your farming path. Your farming path is dialed in. Good job. Way to go. Let's take a look at this. Darth Revan has... Not good speed. So, but you're working on it. You're seven months in the game. You got the right sets on here. You got these speed sets on these characters. That is the way to go. So keep grinding your mods. Daily, daily grind. You're on the right path with the mod grinding on the roster. I love to see it. It is you, 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 you're you're pushing your roster in the right direction. You're doing all the right things. I really like this roster. I really like this roster. You got obviously anybody that's on it that's come on recently or started spending on light speed bundles and had a light roster before, you're gonna be working on mods and zetas forever and ever and ever. I like the idea of the Sith Trio team here too. Great! Hey, good job. Let's just give a round of applause for Roger Roger. Roger Roger. You just loaded up here, buddy. It's looking good. Nice job. Well done. Well done. You're in good shape, man. Start farming wicked. That's all I got to say. You are, you're on the path. You're on the right path. Nice job. Let me check something here. I'm thinking with my mouth open, my wife would be thrilled. Hey, okay, right, there we go. All right, hey, Professor Colin, how you doing? Good to see you. 
Are you a professor? Brian, please see the pinned message. It'll tell you how all roster views work. Oh, I thought I had pinned that I was done. That's not the... How did that pinned message change on YouTube? Did I not pin this? I thought I did. We're full today. Um, hey, Brian Van Hoogen. Brian Van Hoogen. Um, hey, see the pinned message. There's a video in there that talks about how roster views work on the channel. So... We can catch you next time out there for sure. Okay. Let's take a look at uh, CJ Perkins boy. I changed that timestamp. All right, CJ Perkins boy. All right, five minute review. You got anything you want to see? Here's CJ Perkins, boy. Cool. Just got out of church. Congratulations. Let's look at the roster. Let's see what we can deliver here. If we got started, it's going. Okay, so we got Ray. We just unlocked Ray. We got the Radis. So we bought the Ray and the Radis bundles. That's a that's a decent job there. So we got Ray done working on her. What about the first order? What about the first order? I just love that. I just love playing that. You know, that's all I'm saying. Okay, so we got we, we got a first order farm going. We got Smuggler Han, I'm gonna assume. Uh, where is he? There he is, that's Smuggler Han. We got, ooh, oh no. Uh, Xanadu blood needs to be farmed. You've gotta have it to get Kylo, ouch. Ouch. Oh, ouch. Well, start farming those ships for Kylo. You bought those packs, but you need to get those ships, those farm. I'll get you after this review, Malkazel. It's time. So, yeah, get those ships farmed for the finalizer. You're going to need them. Ouch. Really want a Ray there, I guess, huh? Farming the TIE Bomber. So, what I would do is this. It's pretty clear. What you want to do is farm your ships for the finalizer and for the executor. You're going to go get the finalizer done. You're going to get Ray. Or you're going to get Kylo. Finalizer, Kylo. And executor. Those are the next few stops on your path here. Finalizer, Ray or Kylo, and then Executor. I want you to finish your Jedi Knight Revan team. Um, I want you to let's see here. Do you have 3PO? There he is. Okay. So the again, again, the um the CLS team is so somewhere along the way. You need to relic 3PO, relic on solo, relic Chewbacca, get 3PO and Chewie up and running, get them done for this roster. How's CJ Perkins? How's your dad doing? How's little CJ doing up there? Okay, let's see. We got Ray, we got that. Let's look at some speed here. Okay, I want to talk about crit damage on on CLS. First of all, well you're 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 slow. Your your mods are slow. So we'll we'll give you that first. We need we need a lot more speed on the roster. I feel the need the need for speed. Ow! All right, CJ Perkins boy, I want you to stop doing this. CJ Perkins boy, I need you to watch my mods 101 video. Go watch my mods playlist. This should never be upgraded. This is a mod that should never be upgraded. Uh, there's no, I mean, your, your other mods are so good. What's up with that? Your other mods are on path, man. I just don't know what's up with that one. Anyway, let's talk about crit damage on CLS. And to do that, let's go look at Chupio. Threepio and Chewie have a unique. It's called I Must Tell the Others. If the Allied Leader is CLS, Threepio and Chewie gain 40% of the Leader's max health, protection, offense, defense, potency, and tenacity, and Rebel Allies gain half that amount. This is why most people choose to mod CLS with an offense set, with an offense triangle, and a tenacity cross. He's going to share all that offense with the rest of the team. The crit damage does not get shared. It's only for CLS. The offense... The potency, the tenacity, the protection, the health, the defense, all that gets shared with Chupio and the rest of the team. So an offense set is generally a better set to put on CLS. That's just a just an advisor there. I've done some advice out here. Yeah, keep farming mods. Keep farming mods. Get get on it. So think about that for CLS. Now let's go take a look. I already looked at your mods. What else is going on with the roster? Finish your Darth Vader. 
Fast LaShawn Fallen. I want to see a Sith Empire team that's working for you. One moment. Justin Z, Legolas Z, what's up, man? Um, yeah, so get this team up. You got Darth Malak at six stars. Revan, Fast LaShawn, and Darth Malak. These three make a team all by themselves. All by themselves. So get them up and running, man. Get them up and running. Big Ninja made it. Get your intro in a minute. Malakazel and Big Ninja, I owe you intros. One moment. Uh, Relic Jolie Bindle would be good to go Jedi Knight Revan, but you can also start thinking about Jedi Knight, Jedi Knight Luke and Jedi Master Luke down the road. But these four right here, Relic Up, make a really great team with a Zeta on there as well. So keep farming those mods. Keep doing what you're doing. Finish the CLS team. Finish Ray. Uh, finish Ray, obviously. Work on the finalizer and the executor in the background. Finish your CLS team. Finish your Revan teams. That's what you do with this roster. Seal, or, uh, finalizer, executor, Supreme Leader Kylo Ren. In the meantime, finish your CLS team, finish your Jedi Knight Revan team, finish your Darth Revan team. Get those teams up and running on the roster, and that's where you're going to take this roster. After that, you're going to go get uh, the, the Executor, which I already mentioned. It's going to be kind of mixed in there while you're doing all that other stuff. Then you can start thinking about Jedi Knight Luke, Jedi Master Luke down the road once you finish all of that stuff on the roster. And definitely keep hammering on the mods. And there you go, CJ Perkins. Boy, hopefully CJ Perkins is doing very well. Let's say hello to a couple more Masters members today. We got Mel Gazelle. We got Big Ninja. There you go, Big Ninja. I'm gonna go ahead and look up our next one here. Cook Niner. <laughs> What if Cook Niner joined us on Twitch? Maybe not. I don't know. Let's go Cook Niner's ally code here. All right, Cook Niner. Let's get this thing going right now. All right, Cook Niner, Stargaze Centauri. We got a Bosk Bounty Hunter team. I feel a little weird here. I feel a little weird. Let's see what we got here. Um, wow. What is going on? It's a new roster that bought a bunch of Lightspeed bundles and is behind the curve on a lot of stuff right now. Um, like you bought a Finalizer bundle. And the Radis Bundle. Yeah. Um. Bow to the first order. Keep farming that Thai Echelon for sure. Keep finish, finish off the Special Forces. Okay, keep farming that Thai Bomber. That's a good thing, Cook Niner. Thai Bomber is a good thing. So... I'm mean, gonna guess you just got these recently with gifting. So did not buy Veteran Smuggler Chewy. I get that did not or did not get it gifted. So you'll need Veteran Smuggler Han and Veteran Smuggler. Oh, there's Han. So you're pretty close to Ray and Kylo. The ships are what you need. You got the finalizer, right? But do I see the Radis at all? Finalizer four stars, Radis four stars. Okay, so it's just Ray and Kylo, man. It's just Ray and Kylo. That's what you're focused on in this roster. Ray and Kylo, and then you can do other stuff. I would definitely, let's take a look down here. I'll bet you got CLS. Wampa is a character you want to relic up and get an Omicron on her. You want to gear 12 your Geo so you're, you're participating in the raid. You got to get Piet up along with your TIE Bombers so you can get Executor down the road. Um, your CLS team needs some work. Yeah, obviously that's a big priority. And Captain Rex needs work to go with your Phoenix. I mean, it's a pretty, it's a pretty standard... Lightspeed Bundle Farm. I would recommend, I would refer you to my Lightspeed Bundle Farming Guide to get most of what you need. It's all going to be right in there because everything on this roster is Lightspeed Bundles. So let's go look at the speed mods. Cook Niner, go watch my Lightspeed Bundle Farming Guide on YouTube, okay? All right, Grief Karga is your fastest character. I'm a little worried right now. He's not very fast. 96. I think we need to get, it's been all day with this. It's been all day with, with ne people needing speed on their roster. Let's see. I feel the need, the need for speed. Ow! Yeah, you're just really slow across the board, and 
Your mods just are bad. You know, I would you make sure you're hammering mods, Cook Niner. You know, it looks like you you just came out to the game here recently, and you got all the light speed bundles, but you gotta work on your speed on this roster. But um, please, Cook Niner, definitely go watch. Yeah, I think it's an FYM is deserved here. Yeah, for sure. Take these um, two over to the garage, will you? I want them cleaned up for dinner. But I was going into Toshi Station to pick up some power converters. First, you've got to fix your mods. So what I would say is go watch the Lightspeed Bundle Farming Guide. It's going to take you on all the paths you need to go on. But this is going to be a Finalizer into Kylo, um, Radis into Ray, and, and all of that, and keep farming the TIE Bomber and take all that into Executor. These are your next three farms. And other than that, it's CLS. And those are your farms. And also CLS and also... Um, Captain Rex needs to get up and running. You need to get Captain Rex up, make him work, get his second Zeta on him, the bottom ability. Make that Phoenix team really work for you by getting Captain Rex farmed and up and running. That's what you got to do on the roster. That's your that's your main things. Um, I would say you're sharding right now. Should be You should be sharding Chupio, Captain Rex, and Ty Bomber are your primary shards at the moment. And then work on every... I mean, I don't know what else to say. That's kind of wraps. We're, we're a minute and 10 early. Anybody else see anything interesting here that I'm missing right now? We'll check out uh, something here real quick. I would be farming Ad Admiral Radis every day. Just kind of get ready for profundity in the background. That'd be a good smart farm. Or uh, Mod Mothma would be, would be a good farm for you every day. Um, you know, getting Mod Mothma on this roster to and Rebel Officer Leia Organa, Mod Mothma, um, uh, Captain Han Solo. Start getting yourself ready for that Jedi Knight Luke farm down the road. Wampa, uh, Hermit Yoda. Start, pre start prepping yourself for Jedi Knight Luke down the road. So when you finish the Ray Kylo Executor Farms, you can go get Jedi Knight Luke and do something with that. Whether it's Jedi Master Luke or Jabba or whatever. Or just a nice Jedi team for yourself. So that's what I'd recommend for this roster. You're in good shape right now. But the farming path is clear. It's a Lightspeed Bundle farming path. And I got a whole video about it. Go check it out. Um, Cook Niner, I was glad to look at your roster today, man. And welcome to the game. I'm glad you're here. Hopefully you find this for yourself. Hopefully you... Realize you got the roster review, and we will talk to you soon. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to wrap us up for today. I think it's time for a dance party. I'm going to try and maybe get a roster review video out for everybody here shortly. But in the meantime, let's see if we can dance. Hey, where are my porgs? You can see the stupid desk because my porgs aren't dancing. Hey, everybody, I hope you had a great time. I had a good time on the stream. I don't know why we always get this lag. It's frustrating me, but I gotta figure out some way to fix it. Hey! I hope you had a good time today on our stream. I had a great time. I love you guys. Make sure to join Discord. Get some ideas in there for my next free-to-play account. We'll be starting in the next couple of months in that range. Once we finish Java, I love all of you. You're all wonderful people. I don't care what Don M says about you. I don't care what the Roller says about you. Have a great day. I will definitely talk to you soon. Get up and dance. And of course, always remember if I can find it. Hey.